Corina Ganet, get to me, then a morata, morata, a fata, morata, monene, a kerete, a rata, a kerete, a kerete, a Hello, hello. How are you guys? How are you doing? Good morning, good evening, good afternoon from wherever you are watching us from. My name is Shiko Hope and this is your home of hope. This is where we say inawezekana and inawezekana means it is possible. Yes. Is it possible? <laughs> say hi. Hi. Salimia watu. Um, mom, I'm hmm? watching your video. You're watching my video? Yeah. Okay, say hi to our hi. viewers. Uh -huh, say that, tell them your name. Yeah. Mm, Salimia, what to Vizuri? Yeah. Salimia, hi guys, my name is Ian. Hello, my, hello, my guys. Hello, my name is Ian. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> so guys, today is a uh, Tuesday and this is where we normally do our live session. We normally hold our live sessions every week, mostly on Tuesdays. So I welcome you to today's show, today, today's live session. And as you can see from the title, uh, today is the weekly updates on the immigration and everything. On the immigration and everything. And, and I thank you so much and I appreciate you. I can tell Mlifika Mapema, you arrived here at, I think, two hours before time. I can see you have been tuned and waiting and, re and I really appreciate that. So, guys, uh, today, here in Texas, in this our school district, we are the children are on spring break. So this week, no school. They are going back to school next week on Tuesday. So they are enjoying and they are all here. Maybe you'll be seeing one at a time, one at a time, because our mothers are sleeping. And our time here is 1.20. Sasaba, saya lunch. And there is a difference in time. On Sunday, we, we had a spring hour ahead. To Rifika 1 a.m. in the morning, instead of going to 2 a.m., we moved from 1.59 to 3.01. Guy, we lost one hour. We lost one hour. So now you are eight hours ahead of us. And before... You are nine hours ahead of us. So right now we are eight hours behind. We lost one hour. Now we are going to gain it back in fall. That is when we are going to have a fall back. So we will have maybe 12 a.m. twice. Instead of 12 a.m., 12.59, we go to one. We will now go back to 12.00 again. That's how we will gain the hour. I have never understood how that happens, but now things are like that. So, Caleb, you are saying it is daylight saving manenos. Yeah, very, com very complicated. <laughs> very complicated. And imagine it is not in the whole of the U.S. Some states, they don't experience that. Some states, they don't experience that. But it is what it is. Robert Mujuzi, you saying you're watching us from Kampala. How are you? <laughs> Random Chills is saying Kenya is yellow. To Kondani, Karibu Nisana, Karibu Nisana. Agnes Karemi, long time you live. Now you are, now you Kondani. Hmm? Immaculate, Mwangi, you saying you tune from Egypt. How is Egypt, my, my, my sister? Hmm? Ian, umesalimiwa. Esther Kare is saying, hi, Mr. Ian Wajagi. Yeah, that. You saw it? Yeah. Oh, you watching my video? Yeah. Okay. All right. So, guys, today, uh, I don't think we have any development so far from last week uh, because we are still waiting. The DV winners, DV 2022 winners, are still waiting for their two NLs. They are still waiting for their two NLs. And hopefully they are going to receive them maybe next week or whenever the embassy will send them. Mm? Or whenever the KCC or the embassy will send them. Not so many developments so far. Wait, can I tell something? Mm -hmm. Today I'm going to make my, my YouTube channel. <laughs> Sawa, go, 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 go watch. Bye. I will call you when I need you. Okay, this is what I'm saying. The DV 2022 winners, they are still waiting for their two NLs. They are still waiting for their two NLs. But those ones who have been scheduled for the interview, they are now preparing to go to the embassy and some have gone. Last week, we had some who went for the interviews and in Nairobi, that is, in, in the U.S. United States Embassy in Nairobi, and the, their visas were approved. 
that is a win. That is a win for us because we always pray for approvals. We don't believe in denials or APs. Caleb is saying, when is the next visa bulletin likely to be online? It's supposed to come either tonight or tomorrow. Because most of the time it comes mid-month. Mid mid so either tonight or tomorrow. We are going to wait for it. And we are going to see now the movement. Maybe who will be current or anything that will come up during the next visa bulletin. Mostly it comes in mid-month. Brenda Katama, you're saying, how are you all? My sister from Uganda, now living in PA. Hmm? We are doing great, Brenda. Missed you, my sister. We have really missed you. Sweet Lynn, watching you from Ghana. How is Ghana? Hmm? Can you share this video with your people in Ghana? Hmm? Let them come here and watch and, and get this information. Julia Nyawela, are you watching us from Nairobi, Maziwa, Kamiti Road? Oh, thank you so much. Thank you. Chitty Boy, you watching us from Mombasa? Hmm? Mwamba Deuko. Dominic Nyamina, are you watching us from Qatar? Okay, I have, let me look for something here. For these people who are going for the embassy this week and next week. Just one minute, guys. I get this thing here. Hmm. Yeah, we have a WhatsApp group. If you are scheduled for, for your interview at Nairobi Embassy, we have a WhatsApp group now for those who have already received the two NLs. Now that is where people are now. I told you guys we move, we move in stages. This DV Zande is a stage. From this stage to the next stage to the next stage. So Shikohop TV fans, we have WhatsApp group for everybody, for you, 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 you who is watching us right now. That's where you come together, you discuss things, you discuss together. For you who are waiting for the uh, DV 2023 results in May, that is in two months' time. Actually, it is less than two months. Less than two months. And then we have WhatsApp group for the winners, for the DV 2022 winners, those who were selected last year. Now, that, now those ones, they are separate. The winners are separate. And now we have another one for the winners who have already received the two NLs. Now those ones are almost So and if that WhatsApp group, the ones who are in Nairobi Embassy, who will go to the to Nairobi Embassy, once you get your visa approved and you move to the US, you stay for one week in the group and then you exit because we need to create room for the, for the incoming uh, winners as they continue receiving the two NLs. So we work together, we work together, we work together. Once you arrive in the US, you stay there for one week and then you give the others the experience. Now, because you're already here, you give the others the experience, your visa experience, how you transit, how you, you came to America and how you are coping with life in America. So, that those testimonials, you continue giving hope. You continue giving hope. It is like a thread. So we are working as a team, and we are all working as one team. We are in this together. We are in this together. Diana Kategwa, you're saying you are watching us from Tanzania. I'm your diehard fan. Asante sana, Diana. Asante sana. Nashukuru. Jesus love. Uh, green card bado ziko. We are eagerly waiting for results in May. I trust I will win. Guys, let me tell you one thing. I know. You guys, you are always on your cal calendar. You're saying one day down. Mm? To May 7th. Me too. Imagine I'm anxious as you well. are. I can't wait. <laughs> I can't wait for that day. For that Saturday. Where? 
me too it's like i applied but because that thing i'm like more than me how will it happen gosh i can't wait for the celebrations i can't wait he we are going to do it here here on shiko hope live yo siku hakuna kulala Philippa, you sing me here from Ghana. Hey, Team Ghana, big team. Big up, big up, big up, guys. Big up. Why? Ian, una comment? Yes. <laughs> All right. Joyce Wakamau, watching from Kapeguria West Pokot. Hiya, Kapeguria West Pokot. Okay, Asante Sana, Joyce. Thank you so, so much. Stella, you're watching us from Nairobi, Kahawa West. Pesh Pesh Girl, you're watching us from Capital City of Kenya. Paula, uh, Manipata Live, watching from Jericho. All right, Grace Wairimo from Katal, Kama Kawaida. Yeah, you're saying it is one month to go. One month to go. And you know what, guys? I've been getting updates from you, DV 2023 winners. You have even gotten the passport for your dependents. For your kids, Aki guys, mm? you are a level of faith eco top. Mm? You are you are very ready. You don't want to be left behind. Once you, you get selected, you just feel the DS260 and everything, and you wait for, for the 2NL, right? Hey guys, Medipanga, Medipanga Sana. Yobra, you're watching us from Bahrain. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Chidi boy, tuamba wazima kwa sana. One day, yes, usishtuke ni kikubishia kwako. <laughs> karibu sana, karibu sana, karibu sana. MLS Investment, You're watching us from Sierra Leone. Nashukuru, thank you, thank you. I don't know if you understand Swahili, but I really appreciate you. All the way, love from Sierra Leone. Thank you so much. Thank you. Can you continue sharing this with, with people in Sierra Leone? Let them get this information. MLS investment, continue sharing this information. J Kilogram TV, you think, is there any other course and not health related that immigrants can do on arrival? So many courses, so, so many courses. You can do IT, which is a hot cake here. So if, if you are not, that good in health related courses there are some other courses and they are paying well it and some others mm? not some others but many others normally no question i see you asuta you're saying that your daughter is a candidate in the ongoing kcse exams can she fill this year's green card lottery asuta from embu kenya how old is she mm? How old is she? Yula wajina gumu leo ni merauka. Hey, Shiko. Oh. <laughs> Beldaza. Mm, chami. Let me call you Chami. Mm, because your name. <laughs> Grace Wairimo, you saying that you have Miss Brenda. Mm, Kale Motugi, actually, you have counted the days. 53 days to go. Yes, it is less than two months. For the green card result to be out two months away me too i'm very anxious and the other day she was telling me mom the result is in a talk when when are the results out and i'm like i already not it is in two months time and she was like wow mm -hmm. i can't wait to see the winners so even our children they are also interested in this which i know even your kids who know about this thing maybe they are Telling you, mom, I can't wait. I can't wait to go to the US to Akinashiro, Jerry, Ian, right? Be because our because our children, we are in this together. We are in this together. All right. Esther, Esther Boakia Wallace, you saying no interviews yet in Abu Dhabi. What can we do? My dear, you are in Abu Dhabi? Actually, I saw that Abu Dhabi embassy is slow, like our Nairobi, but actually, I think Nairobi is better nowadays. How I wish they can pull up their socks. Esther, I think there is nothing we can do. What we can do is just to pray. Hmm? Just that. 
I don't think there is anything else we can do. Mary Clement, mambo shiko siku nyingi sija kuona sipati alert ukianza live. Mary make sure you hit the notification bell. Make sure you hit the notification bell. That way you'll be notified. That way you'll be notified. You see why we have the name subscribe. Subscribed because you have subscribed, right? There is a bell there. You hit on the top one, the top one bell. That one will be notifying you every time she hope is live. Brother, you saying you back now? Yeah, I saw you. You are on vacation somewhere. <laughs> Maggie Precious, you saying certainly me? I can't wait to celebrate. Yes, that day hakuna kulala. Not sleeping on seventh of May. We'll be, we will kesha. We will spend the night here checking the results. Checking the results for everybody. Dina Mwaneki, you watch, you tuned and watching us from Nairobi. Esther, your case number is six thousand. Mwadani, guy, my dear, continue praying. We are, let's continue praying. This is a very low case number. Very low case number. 6,000 is not a joke. Mm? But my dear, have faith that you get your 2 and L anytime and you'll go there and you get a visa. Let's continue praying, guys. Precious, you saying to Uganda, we love you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Wacha ku comment. Unaskia? Wacha ku comment. Sasa unaandika anini. Hmm? Stop commenting. David Karioki, you are in Angola. Hmm? Kenyans, you are everywhere. How is Angola, my brother? Hmm? Say hi to people in Angola and share these videos with them. Let them know there. Let them get their information. My pawn, all the way from Lesotho. Lesotho. Hmm? Salute, 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 salute. Patrick, you are watching us from Qatar. Wow, wow, thank you so much for the love. Diana Kategwe, you saying, please, do you also have green card process for Tanzania too? Or can you recommend someone? We help everybody. The WhatsApp groups are for everybody. Even if you are a green card winner. We have a, a WhatsApp group for everybody. Sierra Leone, Ghana, wherever you are, Tanzania, Ugandans, the, the members here are from all over, from all over. And 99% are from Africa. So if you are an African, the group is 99% for African. Those are the members that we have right now. Mm -hmm. We have many Ugandans, we have many Tanzanians, we have many Sierra Leoneans and Ghanians in the WhatsApp groups. So Diana, we, have, we are diversified, inclusion, inclusion. Tumwene Muhei, my, my dear from Uganda, you registered but you beg to add me in the WhatsApp group if you have one, otherwise thanks. Let me set the link to the WhatsApp group. If you're not in any of our WhatsApp group, kindly join this group. This group right now, let me see the link. Okay, let me join. Where we join? I don't have a phone. What's up, group? Now, which is the latest WhatsApp group with? <laughs> we have Colorado, Missouri, California, Georgia, Texas, Oklahoma, Kentucky, North Carolina. Mm -hmm. I think all these groups are full. Even if they are not full, they are almost full because some people keep on lefting. That is kawaida. Let me create one now, now, now. Ooh, 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 ooh. Don't comment anything, Ian. So, Sia didn't comment. So, we call this one Ohio. Let's call this one Ohio. Ah, ah yeah. 
there. Okay, guys, the link is down below. In a kujapo. Ian, it's a kujapa. What a comment? What? Where? Kujapa. Come here. Come here. Look. Ona vile mi adika ma yani wajage migi. Look. Look, my yani wajage. Can you go tip them off? Then block me. I will block you. Do it. Yes, I will. Let me see. Let me see if you. I can. Uh huh. I can pin that comment. Imekuja. So that is the link to our new, to our new WhatsApp group. If you are not in any WhatsApp group, kindly join this one. If you are in any of our WhatsApp group, kindly don't join this one, because it makes sense to be in all the WhatsApp groups. Doesn't make sense. So let me time Ian out. Hmm. Yes. To be a buyer. All right, guys, let's continue. Let's continue. Elizabeth Ruga, you saying, Shiko, I really thank you for giving us hope. Kila kitu yiko kwa mpango. Watching from Nairobi, thank you. Thank you so much, Elizabeth. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Derek, how can we join the WhatsApp group? The link is there. Uh, click on the link and join. Baba Tiffany, all right. Mm, that one is handled. <laughs> Esther Kare is saying, E and Eko Dago Kunyo. Eh, eh. Anton Karaja. Hashiko, does the first and L come together with DS26? Amazina Chana Sana. A very good question. The first, um, the first and L, this is the, this is when you check the results. And you find out you have been selected. So this is that information that tells you, congratulations, Anton Karanja. You have been randomly selected for further visa processing, blah, 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 blah. And then they tell you to fill the DS-260. So they give you the link to, to your DS-260. Hmm? And that thing, that one to, to an, not one to an L, no, one and L, it comes with the, your name, your case number, and your, your derivatives. They comes there. By the way, do derivatives come in, in one L? By the way, I'm an, now get to your to an L is the one that comes with the derivatives. One and L. Gonna, let me see if I have copy of one and L. One and L, it only comes with your name, your case number. Yes, your name and your case number. It don't, it doesn't come with your derivatives. It is only for you. But you are given a link where you will do, go and fill the DS260. The DS260 is now the one that comes with the derivatives. Everybody that you included during the application. Everyone is listed there. Because you'll feel a DS2, DS260 for each and every member of your family. Those ones you included during, during application. Has, okay. Okay. Answering your, your, your question is, Amazina Achana Sana has Yachani. Maybe after results, accessing DS260 can be can be maybe kusumbua kidogo because everyone is trying to do it. But after one or two days, or maybe after one day, you'll be able to access the DS260. So has Yachani, has Yachani. Alvi Waiyaki, you're watching us from Deya. Hage Shohe. Hey, that one is a neighbor, my neighbor. Thank you so much, Alvi. Tumuine, you better display the number of one admin in order for us to join Izri Shiko. Asante sana. Asante, uh, uh -huh. so display the number. The link is there. 
join, joining through the link is easier than inboxing someone. Imagine you inbox me, she call, add me to a WhatsApp group. I'll have to add that name to my phone contacts because for, for me now to, to add you, it is better the link. That one is easier. If you continue adding everybody to our phone book, we will have so many contacts. Mm -hmm. Ruth Kemani. Christine Wali, hi, Shiko. We have prayed and, and fasted. We are now thanksgiving, claiming by faith and praising God in advance, waiting for a massive winners and test testimonies, especially from Shiko Hope subscribers. That's our, that's our prayer, Christine. That's our prayer that we'll, we'll be celebrating winners here. We will be celebrating Ian's, the Ian guy winners here. Joseph Aleto, haha, Ian is so funny. At then block me. Do it. <laughs> I did. <laughs> Although you saying, hi, Shiko, I heard from my friend this year you can apply without passport. And if you win, KCC never ask you any documents. How have you seen that? Yeah, they said, uh, no passport when doing the application from this year from this year Brenda Katama is saying watch and sell me Americans here too <laughs> oh my sister you want to join us live Brenda all right all right all right all right okay I'll be saying how can I do it from Qatar you can access everything online it doesn't matter where you are, from online, not from online, from wherever you are, you can access everything. Application is done online. The S260 is filled online. Everything is done online. Waiyaki. <laughs> Brenda, are you here? Block me. Yeah. <laughs> and I did that. Vincent Ondande, Shiko Mambo, tuned in live from Narok, Kenya. Happy to see you, Madam. Good job. Thank you so much, Vincent. And, and say hi to everyone in Narok. Regina, together. Mm. Hi, Shiko. Let's say I had the passport. So my surname is my father's name in the passport. Confirming DS260, do I feel with my husband's name or my dad's as my surname? Okay, that's a very good question, Regina. Whatever you filled initially during application, if you said Regina Wadziro, together, continue using together. Don't change because maybe you want to use your husband's name. Don't do that. Use the name that is in the passport. Don't change because if you change, you will need to have an affidavit to show and to prove that Regina Wajiro Geta and Regina Wajiro Kamau is one person. It's the same person. So there is no need of that. Continue using what you used. Don't change anything. Don't change anything. Anna Wairimo, watching from Gatanga. Thank you so much, Anna. Angela Kenywa, hey, hey, who you are? Kamiti Road and Itafute. We are neighbors. I'm in Kiamombi. Ah, wow, wow. Tafuta Neni. Tafuta Neni. Brenda, guys, like the video. Oh, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Guys, this is our tradition. Whenever we come live here, the first thing is to like the video and share the video with others, and then we comment in the comment section so that we interact. And the best gift that you can give to this channel is just liking and sharing. Only that. Thank you so much, my sister, for that. Paris Moheka, to just enjoy comments, Zayan. <laughs> Be serious. <laughs> Serve the chef. Who wanna kuja tu hata kama ni metelewa? You write on time, although we started 35 minutes ago. Serve the chef, welcome. Haruna, hi Shiko, this is Haruna from Ghana and just praying to win this year and praise Shiko, which city are you? Oh, Haruna, yani you, you have never, eh? You have never <laughs> seen me saying this is this city, this is this city. All right, I mean, little M. Yani kuja apa? Kuja, kuja, kuja. Unia B, eh? Can you say little lit M? Little M. Little M. Little M. Little M. No. 
And you know what? Little M. Little M. Oh, that is where we live. Where do we live? US. US, where? Texas. Texas. <laughs> Which city? Which city? Nairobi. Nairobi. <laughs> hmm? Can you go call Jerry? Tell her to come. Haruna, let Jerry come and answer you. Raphael Boro, you look wow. Tune from Karen. Thank you so much, Raphael. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Karen Kirote, I see you, my sister. How are you? Hi, Akuja. Say, say hi to our viewers. Hello, viewers. Mm -hmm. Continue. Hello. Um, I am Jerry. You feel all right? Uh -huh. <coughs> I am her daughter. Uh -huh. You can see she go Hope TV uh -huh. official. Uh -huh. uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel. Me and what too. is the name of your YouTube channel? Hope Productions USA. USA. Okay. And where do we live? America. Which city? Which state? Dallas. Texas. <laughs> Aya, apa kwetu tukuna ito waze apa kwetu? Dallas. Dallas? Yeah. No, Dallas is far from here. <laughs> in Austin. Ate? Austin, Texas. Apa, Austin. <laughs> Guy, hamujui kwa ni? Huku ni Preston. Guy, Jerry. Can you go outside? Huku ni Aubrey. Huku ni Aubrey. Aubrey? Yeah. This side is Aubrey. And this side? Jujui. <laughs> Nitro M. Yeah, little M. I, I say my little M. Little M. Mama, mama, I say my little. There's no M. It's little M. Oh, little. Little. Oh. Little. Kidogo M. Little. Say little. 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 Not little. 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 Yeah. All right. You're saying it in your English accent, mm. but like anywhere, I'm gonna say you. No offense. English accent. You have to say it like the little L. Ah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Just wanted you to come and tell us where we live. Na pamo anyo le? Hey, I have dreamer. Okay. The shira me shira reason ni muite. Akuje. Eh. Eh. All right, guys, now you have heard we live in little. <laughs> okay. Raphael, you sing hoping to win May results and become a correction officer in TDCJ. Mm, Raphael, all dreams are valid and we wish you all the best. All the best. Al Haji, you're watching us from Dubai. Thank you so much uh, for the love. All the way from Dubai. Diana, do you also have a Tanzania who has not applied when the application has begun? Yes, 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 yes. From wherever you watch us from. Okay. Come here. Hmm? Every day I come live, you are always in school. Kuja hapa usalimia wa say. Estelle Nevid, hi she called me kumis. Nime kumis pia Estelle. Thank you so much. Makena, we make good. She hope you're doing a good job. May God bless you. Amen. Hi, I put a dog at your door. Come here. 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 Come uh, for the new people, new subscribers, because I know you've gained a lot since I was here. Mm -hmm. So, what's up? Uh, my name is Shiro. I am her daughter, firstborn, her beautiful sister. <laughs> and I have not been here in a while. So, for the new subscribers who don't know me, what's up? I also have a channel, Melanin She K E. Shut up, Melanin She K E. You go subscribe, follow me on Instagram, Facebook, TikTok, Twitter, all that. And I love y'all. Big up. So, Shiro, how do you say little M? Uh huh. In English. Tonight, you happy, Shiro. Little M. 
Little L. All right. So that is Shiro. She has a YouTube channel. Melanie in Shi, Kenya. She hmm? don't live in Nintendo. We live in Aberdeen. To go to Aberdeen. Like in the border. Yeah, like we live in Aberdeen. Benton and Little Owl. We live in Abril. Haya, oh. hapa. Watu wa subscribe. Just as Gonjiri watching us from Pretoria, South Africa. Hopefully, I will immigrate to the US someday as well. Amen. Amen, my brother. <laughs> All dreams are valid. And here we say, in our Zekana. In our Zekana. Kala Motugi, your friend. Oh, yeah, David. Yeah, David, do I have a name that is only in my birth certificate? You... Hiya. Okay. Some of someone in Melona. So, Caleb, you'll go to a lawyer. We get affidavits from a lawyer, something to do with notary. I'm not that good in those sites. Myself, I have an affidavit. I went to a lawyer. I paid 1000 and I got an affidavit. So it is not that expensive. It is not that costly. Just go to a lawyer. They will advise you. Okay, here are our YouTube channels. So if you can't see, just go to Chico TV USA. You click like, you know, like there's this watching information. You know, like this, this. You click, you click here. And you see, it will take you here. Then, how does you subscribe here? See, how does you subscribe here? You got some yako. Oh, okay. So, you go here, you see, then you scroll to channels and you see Melanie and Chi and Hope TV, Hope Productions. You say, Yes, they will go there and they will subscribe. Mm -hmm. Angela Kenya is saying yes, DV 2023 had to tuck it jokes. Exactly, exactly. Nicholas Okoyo, you're watching us from Siaya County. Say hi to Ian. Ian, hi. hi. All right. Karen Kirota is saying that's up. Just as Gonjiri, your kids are such a vibe. Your kids are such a vibe. We're a vibe. <laughs> Yabra, hi Shiko. During the DV application, does it affect if you had typing error and spelled the name wrongly? I think so. But why make an error before you submit? Yabra, if you remember last year when we were doing the application, I was coming here daily. Actually, the whole period of DV application, we were having daily live session here. And I was telling you, make sure you double check your application, watch out for any spelling mistake, any, any grammar or whatever. Make sure you double check. You don't want mistakes. If there is an error in your name, imagine you'll need an affidavit. Imagine you'll need an affidavit. Okay, but let's maybe, let's say for example, uh, it is the name Anne, Anne, A, N N N A N N E. That is an and ani. An and ani. Imagine those those two names. Those two names are different. Those two names are different. An and ani. Those are two different people. Let's take a name like Teresia with a H at the end. And Teresia without a H. Those names are those names. Imagine the those names are the same. I was reading somewhere that the H at the end, most of the names which have H at the end, most of those H H's are silent. But any other letter that makes that name different from the other. Angela, yeah, you are giving Caleb, uh, you're telling Caleb to go to a lawyer, they'll do it for them, for him, because you can't do it for yourself. Exactly, exactly, exactly. Alhaji, we're just waiting for the result. I'm 
sure I'm among the winner with lowest case number by God's grace. Amen. Amen. Grace Wairi Mojeri, amekuwa mkubwa sana. Ah, yeah. Actually, these kids, they are growing very fast. Frank Moturi, you're watching us from Nairobi, Koma Rock. Thank you so much. Say hi to people in Koma. Beatrice Wanjiko, watching us from Ruilu. Lawrence Gasha, Gasha Neshiro, Neara Nora. <laughs> Are you sure? <laughs> Anna Wairim, wow, I like Silo's hair. Oh, she has the best hair. Mm? Uh, Vincent Ondande, haha, <laughs> I think I like Ian Teeth. They have really good. <laughs> Say hi to them for me and gift too. Oh, thank you so, so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. The baby is called Favor. Chidi boy, niweke Shiro. Mm? Shiro was here. Thank you so, so much. Death mode. Good day, Madam Shikoi. I came late. Don't worry. You write on time. Bridget, I love Shiro's ac accent. You give me Shiro. Mm? <laughs> Hi, Shiko. God bless you for the good work. Praying to be your neighbor soon. Amen. I told you guys I need a lot of neighbors here. Mm? I need you guys to be my neighbors here. Mm -hmm. That is my prayer that we'll get a lot of neighbors, a lot of winners who will become my neighbors. Eva Mobi, she does hair golds. Mm -hmm. Eva, don't tell her. Ataringa sana. Regina Kemaru, uh, you're watching us from Nairobi. You praying to God who could coming here after winning green cards. Say hi to Jerry, Shiro, Ian, and Favor. Love you guys. Love you too, Regina. Love you. I love the accent of that girl. I wish I can one day. Yeah, my kids talk the same. Imagine my kids, they have different accents. When we were in Kenya, they they talk the with an accent that everybody can understand. When they come here, they change. When they don't want me to understand what they are saying, they speak this accent. Because they know mom will not get everything that we are saying. And when they are talking to me, maybe in English, they speak me with an accent that I will understand. So they know how to switch. They know how to switch American so that they can so that so that they can do well when they meet with their peers at school and everything. And maybe, and then when they come home, they know CC, CC to match up as CC, we are not used to that accent. So they talk to us with simple accent. And when you are in Kenya, they they interacted well with Kenyans when you are in Kenya. So and I thank God because they know how to how to do it, except Ian. Ian, 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 Ameremewa, he's an American. And we, 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 we cannot do anything about that. Jaikario, I have subscribed to both YouTube pages. Well done to the girls. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much, Jaikario. Thank you. And if you have kids, kindly go to Shiro's, uh, Shiro's YouTube channel and Jerry's YouTube channel and let your kids watch those videos. Shiro is a teenager. In May, she will be 14 years. She has a lot of videos, school and everything. School videos and everything. So if you have a teenager or a preteen, let them watch Shiro's video. So whenever they come here, they'll know what to expect as teens and what and how to, to handle their the circumstances. Mm? Michelle, Chantel, hi, Shiko. Your kids are amazing. Same ages as mine. Much love. Now between Texas and Idaho State. Niwa people are in terms of the dollar. Gani Kodu. Of course, I will tell you, Texas. <laughs> of course, I will tell you, Texas. By the way, I don't know anyone who lives in Idaho. Naito Idaho. Mm? I, I don't know anyone who lives there. But I know what it is in Texas or how it is in Texas. So, Michelle, I'll definitely tell you, Texas. Faisal, Mohammed, DV2023, winners to Nakuja, Texas, little M. Karibuni, welcome, welcome. Job, hi, Shiko, I'm a new member of yours and hopefully to join you soon. Thank you so much, Job, and welcome. This is your home of hope. Here we give people hope. Jelly, yeah, yeah, I upload videos. Billy, too. Nakatu, a chatu, hivo. Okay, sound the chef. You know, they are in school. Actually, this is the week that they are on break. 
and you have seen the yarn doing the yeah, yeah. <laughs> but before they go back to school next week they will have done two or three videos now hmm? asukuma wafanye videos shiro has a video she was editing last night so wait for it uh hi shiko i'm a new member of viewers and hopefully to join you soon watching from nakuru thank you so much yeah very much Asuta Gedi, Shiko, I asked whether my daughter can fill this year green card after KCSE. You asked about her age, she's 20 years. Oh, I thought she was doing KCPE. My dear, maybe you wrote KCPE. I'm a name in the Fikiri and KCPE. If she's 20, she's good to go. Let her apply. And yourself, apply and include her. So she can start two chances of winning. Julia Wago, hi Shiko. If you're married and feel as married, but no marriage certificate, what happens if we win? Julia, I think you are new here. There is a video I did about your question and I answered you very, very well. Do this. You see here on top, Shikohop TV, marriage. Type that, Shikohop TV, marriage. That video will appear. Watch it and you'll get your answer. Okay, Julia, watch it. Because if I start explaining here, we will spend like 30 minutes. Go, go watch that video. Type Shikohop TV, marriage. The video will come, will appear. Grace, you saying to Kochonjo, waiting by the God's grace, how are the KCSC certificates certified? That's now the, that's now the, the process where you need to be in a WhatsApp group as a winner so that you can, you can now go and see it is done online. Do this, do this, do this. That is the work of WhatsApp groups. My time, during my time, we were going you are walking in to the neck offices. Nowadays, it is done online. So whenever you get selected, join the WhatsApp group for the winners, and now you work together. Those are the things that WhatsApp group people do together, do together. Even if you are not in Kenya, you can do it from wherever you are. Lawrence Gashone, Kwani Shule inatoka wa Sasaba, apana, they are on spring break, no school this week. Regina Kemaru, please give the video thumbs up, guys. Like, like, like. Imagine, guys. I like to Evie. Mm -hmm. Peter Adego, unasema hata wewa usalimiwe. Hi! <laughs> Steven Gaduku. Hello, Shiko. If it is possible, throw in some apartment or house hunting videos, and I'm sure this will save us a lot. Mm -hmm. Me, I want you to come here. I host you, and I will take you to, to, to hunt the house. Live, live. <laughs> I want you to come and I take you there. Mm -hmm. We take a video with you. Steven. Anyway, I'll do a video on that. I'll do a video on that. Wait for it, Steven. Sparks Monga, invite me, Shiko, there just to visit. I live in Washington. You live in Washington? See you good there. Sparks, come. Come, come. Do the WhatsApp group. I join our WhatsApp group and then in inbox me. Kuja apa? Do you know what are you saying? Kuja and chapa me. Te kuja and chapa me. You want to be chap what? Do it. Do it like you blocked me. When I blocked you. <laughs> MLS investment. Hi, hey, Shiko. During application, I put my surname to my wife's name. Mm hmm but her ID bears her family surname. Is it a problem if we got selected because we have been married since 2018 without certificate? You put your, ma your wife's surname or you put your surname to your wife's name. But her ID bears her family surname. Okay, which ID are you talking about? Is it her passport? Is it her passport? If it is her passport, and then you put a different surname, 
that calls for an affidavit. That calls for an affidavit. If she don't have a passport, let her maybe take a passport using your name. Okay? Anyway, whenever there is a name difference, an affidavit is needed. Tony, hello, Shiko. I love your show. Thanks for shedding the light. This is the best channel for that matter. Thank you. Thank you so much, Tony Julius. I really appreciate. Julie Wagoy. Okay, Shiko, thank you. I'm new. Just subscribed last week. All right. You are home, Julie. Feel at home. Vitalis Mili. Hi, Shiko. I was watching you in the beginning when you started telling us you had done it with the U.S. Soon, I'm going to Canada, end of May. Love your channel, Shiko Hope TV. Wow, 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 wow. To me talk about, we have come from far. When I was giving you my story, <laughs> now I want you to come, guys, and now start giving your stories on this platform so that we can keep on encouraging people, adding hope to them and everything. And everything. Mother Wahoo, I love the way you interact with your kids. Thank you. Mm -hmm. These kids, sometimes it is sometimes it is hectic. Mm -hmm. Imagine now you have seen three of them. There is another one, the small one. Mm -hmm. Who yo? But the small one is there. You have Kwagina Subua. Fifi, hello, Shiko. Please send the link again because last time I didn't manage to join for reasons I don't know. Let me try to to pin it, to pin the link, the WhatsApp group link here. Copy the link. So the link is there. Will I be able to pin it? Yeah, it has pinned there. The link to join the WhatsApp group is already pinned there. Monica Moturi, I see you. Beatrice Wanjiku, Aki Shiku na hitaji kazi sana. Mtu anaweza pata kazi yaje kama huku. Mtu anaweza pata kazi yaje kama huku wedanga high school. Ah, oh, hiyo ni gumu. Even if you went to high school, what I can tell you, try DV, diversity visa and also try um, if you went to high school and also try student visas. If you didn't go to high school, try green. Ah, even if you didn't, if you didn't go to high school, you kiasi. That one is a little bit hard, but inawezekana. You might get married to someone who qualifies, and you can find yourself in America. Shiko, what happens to homeowner wakiamua kuhama? Hey, karebu. Homeowner like Shiko Ho, wakiamua kuhama. Hmm? Maybe I'm in the process of kuhama. Mm, maybe I'm in the process of kuhama. I'll let you know. <laughs> but what this is what you do. Maybe you can sell your home or you can leave it to rent. So those are the two things you can do. You can sell it or you can lease it out. Mama Hart. Hi, Shiko. How is life in Texas compared to other states like uh, North Carolina? Really love your shows. I'm hooked. Thank you so much, Mama Hart. Um, sometime last year, we were comparing states and we did some comparisons. Mama Hart, there are 50 states in America. What we looked at, we looked at the most affordable states to live in and the most, and the states with higher or most high cost of living. And then we compared Two or three states. I, we compared Texas and Arizona. We compared Texas and... Did we compare Kansas? Actually, Texas and Kansas and Missouri, they range. They are almost the same, mm, same level. But, Mama Hart, maybe you can go to Google and Google. Difference, mm, difference in Texas and North Carolina. Um, compare between life in Texas and North Carolina. Google will help you. Salome Kalioki. Hi, Shiko and family watching from Nairobi, Embakasi. Hi, Salome. I used to live in Embakasi. Somewhere called... Guy. I used to live in Embakasi. Uko diko nidiolewa. My neighbors were all cambas. 
MLS investment. Then she called. My question was well answered. Oh, thank you, thank you, and I really appreciate. So that is the link, and it is still pinned above, up there. Join our WhatsApp group if you are not in any of our WhatsApp group. We need you saying Little Elm is a beautiful city. Was there in 2017? Wow! So you were there before me. You went to Little M before me. I came to Little M like um, not last year in 2020. That's when we came here. We moved to this place. Esther Mwangi, suppose two students happen to come there through student visa and get a child. What will be the status of the child? The child will be an American. That is automatic. The child will be an American. Esther, you want to do that? <laughs> but then that, work, that can be a good one. Hmm? Trilling boy, I really like your videos, especially those that you say come with us oh come with us the road trips <laughs> it's been a while since we took a road trip the last road trip we took was when we were going to princeton ah guys wait for a road trip this week hmm? wait for a road trip this week sarah karenjo hi shiko trusting you are well kindly talk about those that came to the u.s and the journey to applying for green card from there all right all right all right i'll talk about that i will beatrice wanjiko thank you dear thank you so much Trilling, i watch you from new zealand by the way hi you are in, you are in new zealand mm? would you like to share the life there if you are comfortable sharing with us join the whatsapp group or send me an email so that we can Hope she calls zero one. Hope she calls zero one. Send me an email here and we can catch up. If you are comfortable sharing your story and the experience in New Zealand, we would really, really like to, to hear more about that. Hmm? Trilling boy. Precious Maggie, you're saying if a single mom without a letter from daddy to prove that he allowed me to travel with the kids. Can that lead to denial of visa? I don't think precious you can reach that point because you can, I don't know if you understand Swahili, but you can chase a kama wewe. A letter, anybody can write a letter, right? If you have his ID number or his ID photocopy, you can do it yourself. That is a very small thing to make you not to, not to get a visa. Frank Muturi, Shiko, do you take your kids to sliding on snow? <laughs> yes. Watch the video on Jerry's channel, Hope Productions USA. There is a video they were playing on the snow. Is it on the snow or in snow? Salome Karioki, yeah, Embakasi is a Kamba land. Yes, I stayed there for, for like six, seven months, and then I moved to Keno. Hmm? Simiu Akasarani. Hi, Shiko. I'm currently in one of the U.S. universities, but in Kenya. We'll be able to come and work there after I finish school, or what is the procedure? Simiu, can you tell us, how did you manage to join a U.S. in, in university? Of course, you are, you, are, you are studying online. Can you tell us how you managed to do it? Yes. Mm -hmm. And the, your question is this. Uh, will I be able to come and work there after I finish the school or what is the procedure? Okay. Are you coming for graduation? If you come for graduation, see me. You, hook me up. <laughs> hook me up. Mm -hmm. There are some things that you can do. Mm? There are so many things that you can do. Actually, I have some people, some experts who have been advising me behind the scenes. Immigration attorney, they, 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 ha they, ha they have reached to me and they are like, Shiko, let's do this. So, Simiyu, if you will be coming for graduation, let me know. Abdala, okay, Abala, hi, Shiko. My birth certificate has only two names, but all my documents have three names. Can there be a problem during interview? Okay, if, 
okay, my birth certificate has only two names, but all my documents have three names. Can that be a problem? That is not a problem. Even me, my own birth certificate has two names, and all the other documents have three names. So that is not a big issue. Precious, Shiko, changing a state cannot affect the kids' studies. No, no, no. Even changing the, even, okay, but by the way, where my kids are studying right now, it is not where we started. When we came, we were living in Plano, Texas. In Plano, along the border. So our address was reading Plano. The school district was reading Frisco. So my kids were in Frisco school district. When we moved here, we are now, the, actually, we, we always move at the border. We are in the border of Aubrey and Litro M. School district here is Denton ISD. So they moved from Frisco ISD to Denton ISD, and they were not affected. And they were not affected at all, at all, at all. Hmm? So even changing a state, how is the effect? It can't affect. Fifi, I can show I'm still unable to join because the link is taking me to install and only giving me option to open WhatsApp and it's not joining. Okay, I feel like crying. How else can I join? Send me an email. On that email I put there. Hope she calls zero one. At gmail.com. That is my email address. Angela, first time to cut the live chats. You appreciated, Shiko. Thank you so much, Angela. Thank you, thank you. Desmond, Madam Shiko, what is the cost of one apartment in Maryland? That's where my host is staying. Well, I don't know. I don't know about the cost of uh, apartment in Maryland. Maybe you can Google. You can Google and check. Mkenya Marekani TV. Hi, we are inside, tuned in from Seattle, Washington, USA. Mkenya Marekani, ni mekumis. Tumemisiana. This is Gary Wainaina, guys. You can as well go and watch his videos on his on this channel, Mkenya Marekani. Hmm? Nowadays, he's releasing video each and every day. Amazing, amazing. Mkenya Marekani, saluti, saluti. Guys, Anything to do with Seattle, Washington, go visit Mkenya Marekani TV channel. You will get amazing, amazing information over there. Monica Moturi, Shiko Kainle, I do take my son to come and work. I do like my son to come and work there. How, how old is your son? Is he uh, of age to apply for green card or student visa? Frank Motuli, unasema salimia mkenya marekani sana. Ame salimika, I know. Jen Wanjiro, hi Shiko. For now, I don't even have a passport, but due to financial crisis. But I know that one day, I will come to the US, my dream. Mungu bele. Yeah, mungu bele and inawezekana. Samuel Waithaka, I've lived in Australia for seven years. I applied for my Australian police clearance, of which I received it seven months ago. And I still proceed with it. Okay, can I still proceed with it for the interviews? Please advise. Are you a DV winner? Are you a DV winner? Hmm? If you're a DV winner, yes, you can. Dennis Kamwana, I'll be graduating by the end of the year. Masters Hope and You have made me feel it is very possible. Hope equal hundred percent. Thank you. And yes, if you are going to graduate this year, come for graduation. Hmm? You'll be graduating for the, uh, by the, Dennis, are you the one who is studying in a university in, a, in America? I'm an inani. you come in a mix mambo? I don't know. If you are the one, come for graduation. Hmm? Shakira Birabo, my sister. Hey, I have missed you. Where have you been? David Kamau, Hello. Mm? Precious, you saying thank you, Shiko. My question is answered. Asante, Asante, Asante. 
Rorwa, I see you. Karamada, hi, she loving you as always. Feel appreciated. Thank you so much, Karo. Thank you. Simiyu, yes. Oh, this is Simiyu and we have Dennis. Okay. Yes, I'll be coming for graduation and I will inform you. I acquired the scholarship and I choose the online program. Wonderful. Wonderful, Simiyu. Wonderful. Yeah. Um, Nitafute. Deborah Derito. Hi, Shiko. Better later than never. I'm finally here. Karibu sana. Welcome, welcome. Alhaji. Shiko, I use my family name with my wife to apply. But her school certificate carry, carry her family name. Is there any problem? Let her get an affidavit. An affidavit will save her from any, any, any question at the embassy. Shiko, you are Shiko. Is it possible to get a company sponsorship to come for USA for a job? Yes, it is very possible. If you are highly skilled highly skilled right now they are hiring registered nurses registered nurses they are in wanakuda since covid hit so many nurses have been coming so if you are highly skilled there is uh there is a way they do it now Shanga is saying what if one is not able to raise cash when he wins green card to travel with his kids and husband's wine wife. Can you travel alone and later your family? Yes! People always do that. And this is how we, you, you can manage my brother. Let's say you have five kids, like me. Hmm? Not five kids. Guy, members of your family are five. So you are the principal applicant. Your wife and your first kid, second kid, or the third kid, or maybe you have, a, or maybe you have one kid, hmm? and you see, we have used a lot of money. The medicals and the visas. Now we are, we are empty. We don't have anything. So this principal applicant, once you get your visas, look for an air ticket, pay for your air flight, and the principal applicant can come immediately because the visas, the other people. The other members of your family visa will be valid for six months from the date of your medicals. So exactly or immediately you get your visas, the principal applicant can come first, leaving all the others back home. The principal applicant can come. God help him get makaratasi haraka. This is the social security. This can take one or two weeks. And then you start working. Una chapa kazi, chapa kazi, chapa kazi, work, 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 work. Then you can send the money for your flight. Or you, you can pay for the air flight even one week before the visas are, are expiring. Okay? And that is it. So you have worked for five months. You have saved enough money to take an apartment and start life. So when your family will be joining you over here, you are not, they're not joining you at your host's place. You have already taken an apartment and you start life there. I normally don't, uh, don't advise you do that and then your family will get you at your host's place. That doesn't make sense at all. There was no need of you coming that early and then your people are joining you at your host's place. Let them join you Immediately you have gotten an apartment, let them come to the, your home. Because you have worked hard. You have enough savings to start life in your own apartment. Yes, Nashoinga, I would really recommend that. Yes. And if you have money, maybe you can come, both of you, you and your wife, leaving the kids behind. Be Coming both of you, that will double your savings. Hmm? So when the kids are coming, now you're good. You have furnished the apartment. You're good. Now you will be happy as a family. Nashoinga, yes, I recommend that. And it is possible. Fifi, you saying you have you have sent Kyle a check? Yes, I'll check after here after we are done with this slide. Milikoesh, hi Shiko. Feel appreciated. You have made me realize that it is possible to achieve our dreams. Regards, 
to Kenya Marekani you two are doing great. Thank you. Thank you so much Mili. Yes, inawezekana. Lawrence, you saying ebu niambie SMS moja ya simu ni how much huko nitafuta venye naweza penyeza biashara yangu huko. Eh? SMS moja. Imagine I don't know. You know what? We pay our phones. Our phones are we are billed each and every month. And our phones, we calling and everything. I don't know how much we are charged. I don't know because it is a monthly bill. It is a monthly bill. And we have bundled it up with the internet. And I think we pay 100 I don't know about SMS and everything because whenever you are doing SMS, you are SMSing someone who is still here. I'm not talking about I'm down to one braid. One more braid. Yeah. I almost one more. I have to come here. I have to come here. I have to come here. One more. Sawa. I have to come here. I have to come here. I have to And you started yesterday. You have to come Mm. Yesterday, yeah, we can't hear you. I started, you know, the day before yesterday. Well, what is it called? The day before yesterday? Eh. Night or day? Yesterday, Kutua. <laughs> uh -huh, yesterday, Kutua. Eh. Mm. Nilikuwa, nime, um, yuka nime aza kuikat, mm. afu nilieka iso big beads. Mm. Kwa bag, mm. afu nilitura shio brini na nimekati. Mm. E, afu, afu, nilikuwa, metu, nilikuwa nime kaka kidogo. Mm. Afu nilikuwa wati mtaanza kubraid tomorrow, which is mm. yesterday. Mm. E, afu nilianza jana, lakini mm. nilianza eight. Mm. Asi kukua nimemaliza, nilimaliza hii yote jana. Mm. Afu usa hii nitamaliza hii hapa. Sawa. Mm. All right. All right. Okay, guys, Lawrence, I don't know how much they are charging for SMS. I don't know. What we use, uh, if you want to communicate with people back home, we do WhatsApp calls or we use a, another app called Boss Revolution. That's when you want to call them direct. And when I call you direct to your Kenyan phone or your Kenyan line, you will not see my, my American number. You will not see plus one, blah, blah, blah. No, you'll see a number. Actually, they come like, te, like telecom number. You'll not know if it is an American number calling. It's in a change. It changes. But it is so costly when we are calling direct. When you call direct without the post revolution, it is so costly. But this app, Boss Revolution, it is a lit, uh, it is a bit cheaper. It is a bit cheaper. When I put ten dollars, I call people back home for two or three days before uh, that ten dollars is is finished. Shakira, you saying I got married after applying single? Should I continue single or married? <laughs> if you have a marriage certificate, you can include your spouse in the DS-260, so long as you have documents to prove that this marriage is not fake. Oh, so you got you got married and you have been lo you you uh -huh, I'm lost cause of my wedding ceremony. Okay, welcome, welcome to to the club of the married. <laughs> welcome, welcome, and congratulations, Gideon. How about trade schools or vocational institutes? Are they accepting international students? International students, what I know so far is that you can apply in community college, you can apply in universities. I don't know anything to do with um, trade schools. Someone explained to me what is a trade school. I don't know. Geraldine, you think, hi, Shiko, before I got married, I have already had a daughter with someone else. What document do I have to show to prove she's my daughter? Birth certificate. 
birth certificate has mom's name and, and dad's name. If it doesn't have dad's name, then you go to go because that shows that the dad is not present. Dad is not present. So you just need a birth certificate. Career TV Kenya Shiko Hope. I'm a Kenya registered community health nurse. Connect me with direct hire. Wow, you are a registered nurse. Join our WhatsApp group. The link is up there. Join it and then inbox me. Registered nurse are hot cake here. Christine Wamishiko, is one allowed to work like 15 hours in a day? Ama, there is a limit. Super work, Sishiko. Okay. Yes, you can work even 20 hours so long as you are not working the same workplace. Okay? You can work. Even if it is the same workplace, that is double shift, 20 hours, but you can't work like every day. They need you. Wellness. They need it because they know you will be Utaisha. You will be Sukuma. Hmm? Christine, we say, Oko Koro Enyeni, Kuisha Kuisha. So, maybe you can have another job here and, an, and another one there. Or if you're working doubles, it is not every day. Most of these jobs, they don't allow you to work doubles every day because you'll be finished. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Alhaji is saying you have my certificate. You also need a affidavit of support. I can't remember your question, Alhaji. Alhaji, what was your question? You saying, okay, it is this one about your wife. You used, she will need a she will need an affidavit to prove that these school documents and this application, the names are different, but it is the same person. So she will need an affidavit. She'll need an affidavit. Esther Jerry, hi Shiko, you always give me hope. I always watch your videos and feel motivated. Hadi na ziona nikiwa US Aki and by God's grace this year, 2023, I have faith that I'm among the winners. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yes, inawezekana my dear, inawezekana. Na unasema, this is my third trial, but you won't give up. Never giving up, never losing hope. Continue, continue until you achieve. Vincent, you saying you get a host in Colorado, but you wanted to live in Texas. How can one go about it? You can relocate anytime, anytime. Actually, most of people who are in Texas right now, the ones that we were mingling with, most of them imagine they have relocated from other states. Most of them have relocated from other states. I don't know. Very, very few people landed here and settled here. Most of people in Texas. Actually, Kenyan community, Kenyans in Texas, most of them relocated from other, other states. I don't know what happened, but they normally come here. They relocate to Texas. So, Vincent, you can relocate anytime. Veronica. John, you saying hi, Shiko. Is in embassy? Do they ask for KCSC certificate? I'm a resort sleep certificate. The certificate itself. J uh -huh. Jotieno, I see you. MLS, you saying ah, please pardon my frequent questions. No problem. My pro my passport I applied with junior application will be expiring in July 2022. If I get selected. How am I going to remedy that situation? Get a new one. Renew this one. Just renew it. And when you go to the embassy, just carry both of them. The old one and the new one. They know these things happen. Okay? Even if you lost. Now, the US is a good case because you have the old one. Even if you have lost your passport that you used during application, replace it. Uh, and of course, you, you, you will have an abstract to show that you lost your passport. So when you're going to the embassy for the interview, carry now your passport and an abstract to show the passport that you used initially got lost. They understand. Sharon, do you use certificates Ulipewa after Kumaliza, for example, your high school? Yes, that is the KCSU certificate that you need to take with you to the embassy 
for the interview. Sera, shkoko hanate ya kwega fio. Alhadi, okay, thank you for the answer. May God bless you. Amen, amen, amen. Clifford, my neighbor, you are watching us from Nebraska. Hmm? Clifford, I told you during my graduation because my school is in Nebraska, Bellevue University. You would only host, you'll host me. You'll host me in your home. <laughs> hmm? Can you tell me, is it far from where you live? Nebraska, you not, not Nebraska, Bellevue University. Robert Mujuzi, Shiko, can someone who retired from work a couple of years ago be my host and sponsor? He can be your host and, and sponsor. If at all he is, he qualifies to be a sponsor because if he can provide the documents that are needed for a sponsor, definitely he can sponsor you. It doesn't matter whether he retired or not. Maybe he has some savings. He's good to host and sponsor you. Philippa, you sent a message to KCC and they said, my case is current. So I'm praying my 2 l will come soon. 17,000. Oh my goodness. Yes. Let's continue praying. You are not alone. So many people who are current have not yet received the 2 ls Let's co continue praying things will move in place mm -hmm. soon. Let's hope it is it will, it will happen soon. Get the 2 l go to the embassy and get that visa in Jesus' name. Life and cut. Hi, Shiko, you say you'll update us on student visa requirements. Yes, wait, I'm working on that. I'm working on that, my dear. Wait, wait for it. It's coming. Philippa, you're saying that Ghana Embassy is low, though, but the faith is there. Yeah, let's keep hope alive. Even if they are slow, God is still on the throne. God will make them work. Mm? The door that the Lord has opened, nobody can shut it. So, Philippa, let's continue praying that everything will, make, will move in place. Sarah, you're saying she could have a relative in Boston. How is that city you come again? I have never been in Boston. What I know is that that place uh, experiences snow. That's what I know about Boston. Nothing else. <laughs> and I have my friends who live there, and they say that place is good. So it is not bad. Hmm? But who could have snow? Chitty boy, there, when you're here, kwa mutihani, wanapata hiyo job, wanapata job huko? I don't think so. The job are for the highly skilled, huh? highly skilled people, like nurses. Those ones right now, if you are a registered nurse from your country, you're good to go. SCNJ Mo, hi, Mambo Shiko, poa sana, poa sana, poa sana, poa sana. Tuanela ilifika. Ama bado. <laughs> Simiu, may the God of Abraham never stop to amaze you with his goodness because of what you're doing. You're one in a million with a good heart and may blessings follow you in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Limitless Cliff. The, uh, these people, when you when you went a visit, then wanaenda wana kuwa chini mazi. But they struggle a lot and all that because wako hapo illegally. Of course, struggles are there because you don't have the makara, you don't have the papers, but eventually you learn how to work things work for you, and even if it will take long time, most of the time they, they succeed. But yes, the struggles, they struggle a lot. They do, they do, they do. Jacqueline, you're saying, please, my son, have but the resort trip. The certificate are not yet out. So how can one do this in case of embassy? Before he goes to the embassy, maybe the, the certificate will be out. So no worry, no worry. No worry. Joseph Wango, hi, Shiko. Thanks for the advice and guidelines. In our second, next year, I'll text you while I'm there. You are my role model. Thank you so much, Joseph. Thank you, thank you, and all the best. Deborah, hiya. So if you win, you can't process your documents, then later, Kishida, you start processing for your kids. No, 
the passport interview and visa no you process everything together the only the, the only point that you can leave them behind is when everybody has eh? it's when the, everybody has a visa now you can first go and then they join you later but anything else medical interview and everything you work together as a family okay deborah yes it's like that because fiscal year like the people like you who applied last year you applied for the dv 2023 right your process will start september no will start october 1st 2022 from from october 1st to september 30th 2023 so there is no way you can go to the embassy next year in august and then you make at the you leave your children and whatever and then you you expect them to go to the embassy later and no that year is done now you'll be they will be uh processing for dv 2024 so you work together as a family until everybody has a visa now you can go first and they join you later it is like that my dear sarah you really give me hope shiko i hope all our dreams come true soon may god bless you amen amen in our zekana how much is visitors visa visitors visa is i think 18000 Investing with Lucy, Aisha, hey my dear, where have you been? Hmm? You saying we'll join you to Shiko. We'll join you Shiko. Welcome, welcome my dear. Hmm? This is another lady. She is in Washington, Seattle. Hmm? They're in the same state with Kenya Marekani and she's doing amazing. Actually Lucy, oh you, she is a nursing student, my dear. Are you done with your nursing school? <laughs> that me love kidogo and then she advises in you see investing she advises money matters so you can uh, visit her channel and watch her videos there lucy nimekumisa sana sela you saying god bless you watch atulala kushukran after watching updates you all right all right when you want lala laleni salama mwangi hi shiko kindly enlighten us about Kenyan embassy about what mm -hmm. about what lucy oh you want to join the this live sawa sawa let me let me send you the link grace wangoi how much is visit visa hiyo nimekujibu sj mo waishe waiting they said several weeks sasa hata nafikiria kwenye mtaacha toto tukifika haha hata ulisema tunaacha wapi I see and demo. Oh my goodness. I know you have a small baby. So you will work your schedules. You will work your schedules. You know who is working days, who is working nights or you can decide let's take the baby to the daycare. You can decide that. Hmm? You can decide take the baby to the daycare. Menapal, hi Shiko, you are able to give us community colleges and is it possible to do nursing if I have a bachelor degree in a different Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Yes. Chidi boy, by any means I will come. Yes, you will. Elvis, hi Shiko, remember we met that night when you were landing back to Kenya. Guy, ni wewe. My question is, do registered pharmacists have pri privileges like registered nurses? I don't know more about pharmacists. Maybe I check on that. But in Benzi, I remember you, guy. Yes, when we landed to Kenya, JKIA and we were cleared. Nilisikia shiko up. So, ni wewe in Benzi, guy. Asante sana. Mm? Yaani unalizua nikiwa na mask. Or, or you just recognized my clan because we came together. Mm? <laughs> Let me send Lucy the link so she can join us here at our be my nursing. Lucy. Lucy Aisha sending you the link asap asap asap. Stream yard. Let me send you the link my dear so you can join us. 
invite a guest. Lucy. One minute, guys. Kindly, kindly. Lucy Seattle, that's how I have saved you. Yeah, join us, my sister. Join. Jadida Modani. Hi, Shiko. Today, I'm lucky to find you live. I missed you. Keep doing good. God bless you. Thank you so much. God bless you too, Jadida. Agnes, suppose one wins the green card. Now he or she is a radiographer. Is there a chance for working as a radiographer in the US? Or what are the process involving to acquire? Yes, that's what I said. Agnes Dirago, actually you need to watch the video I did in Kikuyu. I told you, what you have studied in your country, don't leave that certificate behind. Come with it. A radiographer is a radiographer. Whether you are in Kenya, whether you are in Gulf, whether you are in Canada, a radiographer is a radiographer. You just come here. You'll know what is needed of you. Uh, which class you'll attend, how long, and then you acquire your license, and then you start working. Okay? Agnes Dirago, kindly. There is that video I did in Kikuyu. Watch it. Actually, you'll understand it better. Esther Mwangi. Shiko, now that you are talking of locus numbers, how, uh, you are talking of locus numbers, have not received to any. Can Embassy close them out before they are interviewed? Guy, Esther, this is a very hard question. Let me tell you one thing. They are current and they have to process until September 30th. Let's hope everybody who is a winner, whether you are 10,000, whether you are 60,000, Let's hope you will get the 2 nl and get a chance to be interviewed. Esther, don't ask me if I think they will be closed out. We hope for the best. Okay? Let me not say yes or no. We hope for the best. Precious Maggie, Shiko, if I win and I get visas with my kids, can I leave them like four months and then they exactly that what we said, my sister. You can. Jacqueline, woo. We love you. We love. We love but you. But you what? Umemaliza. Have you finished? Okay. Manenta Kitururu watching from Tanzania. Asante sana. Asante sana. Nahashan Masharia. Hi, Shiko. Kailisha was up. Naba Shiko. The WhatsApp group link is attached. It's pinned there. Up, up, up. Click on it and join our WhatsApp group. Mm? Yes. Yes, yes, yes. My dear, how joy, Lucy? Lucy, Lucy, Lucy. Join us, join us, join us. So, guys, 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 what is the time in Kenya, in East Africa? Sun, ne? Almost 11. <laughs> all right, all right. Mm-hmm. I don't think there is any pass, any comment I have not read. Let me dwell on this comment here. Shiko, are you able to give us community colleges? Uh -huh. And is it possible to do nothing if I have a bachelor degree in a different field? I told you yes. I told you yes. And actually, when you have a different, when you have a bachelor's degree in a different field, when you come here, imagine you can join, you can do accelerated nursing, and that is BSN, bachelor's in accelerated, not bachelor's degree, you do accelerated nursing for one year. So you will not get an associate degree, you will get a bachelor's in nursing. So once you do that accelerated nursing for one year, utaruka yule mtu mwenye hana bachelor's na umempata hapa. Penda pool. Sorry, I don't think you can understand that Swahili. This is what I'm saying. Come here with a bachelor's degree in a different field. Let's say for example, which degree? Accounting. And then you come here and you say I, I want to do nursing. You go and register for accelerated nursing. That is nursing for one year and you do bachelor's in nursing so after you graduate imagine you are far far ahead than someone who already has an associate degree 
Yeah, I can yeah, I can see it is almost 11. Duncan Kizuka, if someone wins the green car lottery, do you organize for host as a hell? Hey, Duncan, Duncan, Duncan. You're reading my mind. Actually, all these things are underway. Guys, all these things are underway. Because you have been telling me, Shiko, Utani host. Shiko, you will host me. Shiko, I don't know anybody in America. Shiko, I have booked you. You are going to host. <laughs> I have been booked by like everybody. And the, the plans are underway. I don't want people to get problems. Remember, guys, we start together when you didn't have any information. Shiko Hope came and maybe created awareness about this. Last, TV, uh, last year, I told you guys, suffering, suffering, cyber, go there and apply. Then come May, we check result. We find winners. We walk through, we walk through you. We walk with you through the process until you get your visa. And then you are like, Shiko, I don't have a host. Shiko, my host has refused to host me. What am I doing? What am I going to do? What am I going to do? Uh, 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 uh. And then Shiko is there like this. We are working on the hosting and accommodation. Guys, continue praying for us. I'm telling you guys, we have so many people working behind the scenes. We have, we are looking at everything. Mm? Work together. Work together until you arrive here. So wait for it. It is coming. It is coming, guys. I'll just come here live and I'll tell you, no worries about hosting no worries about accommodation in America. Shiko is here. Wait for it, guys. Wait for it and continue praying for Shiko Hope. Mm? I told you guys I want many neighbors. We can't be neighbors when you come and you go to Seattle. You not be my neighbor. If you come and go to Colorado, you are not going to be my neighbor. Imagine someone in Kenya saying that someone in Angola is a neighbor. No. But if you come to Texas, that is a neighbor, right? Mm -hmm. uh -huh. This girl here, Christine, is saying, Shiko, I suggest you open a host agent for a fee. It is underway. The plans are underway, my dear. Okay? Wait for the wait for it. Wait. Just wait. Kidogo to Evie. Mm -hmm. So continue praying for me, guys. Sijalala, I'm working. I'm working, not myself alone, but we have other people working behind the scenes. Wait for it. Hosting will be something of the past. You not, you not worry about hosting, okay? You guys, continue praying. Continue because in boxes, I have booked you. I have booked you. I have booked you. And I'm like, guy, my house is so small. How am I going to do it? But God is working. And everything will fall in place. So, guy, 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 wait for it. Hmm? All right, all right. Huh, I don't want to. So, Duncan Geduka, hmm? Duncan Kiduka, that is it. And then Christine, I'm a Sam Ahivo, have said about hosting for a fee. Yes, of course it will be for a fee because nobody will take care of that. Mm? It, you guys, you know bills and everything, but wait for it. It is coming. It is coming. Precious, uh, if you're a main applicant, go fast in America and you receive your green card and social security. That will not affect your dependents to get your green card when they join you later, of course, yes. BM Africa, how are you, sir? How are you? How are you? How are you? All right. Uh huh. In Benzi, how does a green card winner take to join the boot camp? And can you talk about the boot camp, please? Imagine you can come today. After you receive your green card, join tomorrow. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Hmm. Jacqueline, may God bless you. May God bless the plan. Amen. Amen. Nahashon, may God bless you always. You are doing great, Shiko. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Guys, I think even before the end of this March, all the plans will be complete. We are three quarter done. We are all, 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 uh, only remaining with a quarter of it. Hmm? That's a good one. Right? 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 Precious. 
Maggie, you pray for Yushiko exactly, and I thank God, and I appreciate for your prayers, for your prayers. Now, let me introduce Lucy. She's here. Let her come so that we can hear what she has come to tell us. Hi, Shiko. Hi. <laughs> How are you doing? I'm good. I'm good. Oh, I've missed you so much. <laughs> can you tell me what, I'm, what I will do to my background? I'm a, let, let me see. Yeah, that way. It is better that way. Uh -huh. Welcome, Lucy. Thank you so much. Aki, I can't hear you very well. I wish I had my earphones, mm. but I can hear just slightly. So, but I, you can, can you hear me? Yes, we can hear you well, well. Okay, so have you been? Good. Good. Okay, good. Nice to see you. Hi, guys. Everyone who's watching me, my name is Lucy. My channel is in, uh, Investing with Lucy Aisha. Uh, I talk about um, investing in yourself, um, student life in the U.S., and also opportunities in investing, whether it is back home or in the U.S., and how you can even um, improve improve your your or level up. You know, like improve yourself to get more financial independent. You know, to get opportunities in the U.S. scholarships. Um, anything that's going to level you up as an individual. That's what I talk about in my, on my channel. <laughs> and you forgot to tell us you are a nursing student. Oh, I'm a nursing student also. Oh, by the way, anyone who is interested in the nursing program here in the U.S., whether you come as a visitor or, uh, or you're even at home, my channel, I also talk about the nursing program. If you have any questions, kindly go to my channel, subscribe, ask me any questions. I've done so many videos on how you can come to the U.S. as a nurse or even as a student or even as a visitor or even any kind of way. So long as you step your foot in the U.S. and do nursing, I am here to tell you that it's possible and it's going to get you your green card. The people who don't have a green card, please don't give up. Don't give up. Um, there are so many ways to come to the U.S. You just have to know um, which ways and what, how much, how are you able to come. There are many ways. Don't give up. Green card is not the only way. You can still come here as a student, as a visitor, and you, you will learn the ropes once you get here. You will learn what to do and what not to do for you to stay here legally. Here, me and Shiko, we talk about the legal ways. Not come here, just stay in Yamaji or under the water, no. They're all legal ways to stay here. And and you have to you have to sacrifice, by the way, Shiko. Tell them, tell these people that they have to sacrifice. Even that green card, when you come here and you have like four kids at home, there's a way they can even prevent you from bringing those kids if you don't have some type of money. But you must sacrifice for some time in order to get Anything you want, whether it's here in the U.S. or in Kenya, anywhere, you must sacrifice. So uh, those people who are watching, you're watching thinking Shiko, Shiko's transition to the U.S. was easy. But I'm pretty sure it was kind of hard. Where's the money is involved? Shiko, you need to tell them that. <laughs> yes, I normally tell them. I do. Hmm? Now, Lucy. Yeah. Someone who has a bachelor's degree in a different field but wants to do nursing, advise that person. Okay, so if you have a bachelor's degree from home, it doesn't matter whether it's nursing or accounting or uh, actuarial science. Some people have engineering or IT or anything, after, in, after international relations. Mm. If you have a bachelor's degree from home, apply to, you can do an accelerated BSN. BSN is Bachelor of Science in Nursing. And then you become a nurse. Then you do now the nursing board exam. It's called NCLEX. And then you become a nurse. And then you can get your green card. There's so many hospitals and organizations that can sponsor you. Now, here's the thing. Most people who are watching are probably at home, Kenya, Nigeria, India, whatever. You have that degree. One of the best ways I'll tell you Instead of doing the accelerated bachelor's um, BSN, like if you're applying from home, that's going to be very expensive. Mm -hmm. So what you do, try an MBA program 
that is like one year, I can tell you for sure, one that I know, Seattle City University, they don't require you to have a GMAT exam, which costs you like 20K, 20,000 Kenya shillings or even 30,000. You can apply to that. Yeah. It is Sorry? Shillings, it is in dollars. Yes. Uh, no, no, no. The, like, I mean, the GMAT, the GMAT exam is like for if you have a, a degree and you want to apply for a graduate program in mm -hmm. Kenya, that's okay. what I mean, like 20,000 in Kenyan shillings. Oh. I'll get back to the accelerated BSN. Okay. You can yeah. apply for that MBA, come to this, get your visa, uh, student visa at the embassy. When you get here, go to school, yes, the first semester, but go to the um, international student section and tell them, hey, um, I was, um, I'm, not, I'm not able to like continue with this program. It doesn't fit me. Change your program into a nursing program at a community college. Then you get to have your fees slashed by half. Mm. And then you get to extend your stay because now you'll be doing an associate degree in nursing, which is very cheaper and, and it takes you about two to three years. But of course, you must be wise, extend it so that you stay here more okay. as you plan on how you're going to get your green card. That is the cheapest way. But if you want to go the accelerated BSN, once you come here as a visitor or any kind of uh, visa you get, at even a green card, accelerated BSN, it's possible to do it when you have a degree, but you must have prerequisites for nursing program, which means you must go either you, either you do it at a university, which is damn expensive. It's more expensive. Or you can do at a community college, which is cheaper because um, community colleges, they want everyone to go to school. So it's way much cheaper, whether you're international or a local resident, it's cheaper. So the point is, that I'm trying to say is the accelerated BSN, it's possible but most people who come here don't have the money. It's actually almost $40,000 for the whole program. That's like um, $11,000, which is like 1M each semester. Because the accelerated program is mostly four semesters, five semesters, six semesters. Mm -hmm. So imagine paying over $10,000 per semester. That's 1 million Kenya shillings per semester to do accelerated BSN. And for me, for my channel, because I don't like debt, consumer debt, this one for students, I opted to go to the community college by the way she go. Because I saw, why should I pay $10,000 per semester? I don't have, I don't, I, I'm not, I don't have, I don't have um, $10,000 to pay back for students, um, for a student degree. No, that's. I mean, you have to work smart because the student loan, if you guys are watching anything to do with the U.S., you must know that people who've, who've got student loans are suffering seriously because the law, the interest keeps increasing every single year or month. I don't know. Yeah. Chico, I hope you don't have your, you don't have any student debt loan. <laughs> Me, I don't pay for my school. My oh, job, yeah. My job covers 100% tuition. Good job. Good job. So, yes, yes, we have accelerated um, BSN, but I will tell you for sure, that is very expensive. I know some people opt to do it, but don't get into debt, by the way. Yeah. Do not get into debt because the consumer debt here, it's, it's serious. It's crazy. And if you can do it at a community college for even a, a third of the 10K per semester, like 2,000 per semester, why not do that? It's going to take you almost the same time because even accelerated BSN requires you to have prerequisites, you know, prerequisite for the nursing program. And the program accelerated BSN is so competitive that you might miss, like, for example, the school that I know of, University of Washington, they only take people once per year, which is fall, and fall is September. Mm. So... If you miss out on the September lot, you have to wait for the another year to get into the accelerated program, you know? So nursing program for community colleges, it's way cheaper, way easier to get inside. You're still going to get the same value. 
and you still want to work when you come here so you don't want to spend so much time um looking for i mean like so much money studying a program that it's going to end end up you're going to end up having lots amount of debt you won't be able to work because it's like 22 credits per semester 22 credits yeah. like it's like um four units like four units to study but you must pass all of them in order to go to the next semester and a community college you can actually do like 10 credits five credits you know or or um 15 depending on the amount of work you have if you have kids if you have a family if you have to work home and pay off your debt at home just go through the community way okay so that's it those are that's my <laughs> my nugget somebody is asking lucy can you give us community colleges we can try hi i've done um several videos on community colleges L like the cheapest i did i think i've done five or ten five cheapest community college you can go into the u.s check out my channel she go post my link on your comments yes, <laughs> so that yes, people can yes. come to my channel subscribe and see the uh, community colleges that i've selected i am at um Everett community college but the thing is community college it's cheaper for everyone but if you're international if you are an international student it's going to be slightly expensive but it's way cheaper than a university degree yeah and one tip also to tell you guys, if you go to the embassy and you have a degree or you have a diploma or whatever the course you have, for example, um, business management, if you're going to the embassy to look for a student visa and you already have a diploma or a degree, just look for a course that is related to what you did. You know, if you're doing, if you did business, go to the embassy, you're telling them, oh, I'm going to advance a course that is related to business, which is now. If you're working somewhere, you're going to say, hey, I want to do this course because I have a management position that requires me to do this course so that I can come back home, work at this position. They're increasing my salary. I, I love what I do. So it's not like you're going to the embassy and tell them you had a diploma in business and then you go to the embassy and you tell them, hey, I want to do nothing. So why do, why do you want to do nothing? Oh, because, because it has money in the US or because it's it's... You know, it's, uh, you love it. No, don't confuse the embassy. Tell them the same thing that you're doing. When you're coming here, when you're coming now, when you're transitioning, when you get your student visa, when you come to the school, the first day or the second day, go to the admissions or enrollment or international student section and change your course to a nursing. That's the trick. That's the trick. People don't want to tell you that, but that's the trick. Never confuse the embassy with anything. Tell them straight what you want. You know, at the back of your head, when you come here, you're going to change the course, you know? And I encourage people who, who for nursing, uh, people to do nursing, number one reason, it has jobs. You'll get a job any day, any time. Number two reason, you'll get your green card. If you know what has brought you here and you come here as a student or a visitor or anything, with nursing, I can guarantee you 99% you'll get a green card if you know where to look for for that green card. Okay? I think I've talked too much. Chico, just guide me. I'm, I'm struggling to hear you, but I'll listen. Continue. There's this guy here, Frank. He's saying that his wife is studying for pharmacy tech. She works at Walmart and they pay for it. That is it. Mm? That That's is it. Good. Actually, if you are, if you can do IT, if you are good in IT and everything, that's a good one. Right, Lucy? Yes. IT is 100% good. But now, IT, you must put a lot of effort. IT is not easy, by the way. But in everything, even nursing, oh my gosh, I'm almost finishing my prerequisites. And let me tell you, I was struggling with biology, anatomy. <laughs> so, nothing is easy. But IT is also a huge sector where most companies, because they have a lot of money, mm. they can sponsor you with either. There are two, uh, two types of visas IT can give you. It's called a H-1B visa, mm. which most Indians get. Yes. Or even Kenyans we have, but it's not that. It's not common because people don't know about it, you know. Mm. 
So H1B visa and then also your green card. So what happens with the H1B visa, you must good at what you you must be good at what you do. Okay, so they'll sponsor you whether you have a degree or not. You know IT is about skills. So mm-hmm. if you are applying to a certain company whether you're from home. I also did a video on how you can look for um IT sponsorship jobs on indeed.com. I'm not sponsored to say that. It's just information. You can go Google IT sponsorship gro- um job with green card. You Google find that company, apply for it. They will test your skills. If you're good in your IT skills, if you can go back to do IT also and perfect your skills, there are so many companies who are willing to work to sponsor you. Most people, most IT companies, first of all, they give you H1B visa which goes for three years. You're only allowed to renew it once, so you're going to renew it to another uh, three years. So that's gonna be like six um six years after that if they're willing to proceed with you they'll sponsor your green card but in the meantime those six years already life has changed maybe you got a boyfriend who is a citizen or a green card holder or you know you've gotten another opportunity to get your green card yeah. within six years it's a good amount of time to look for plan b if plan a doesn't work and the processes here they are slow but they are sure, like, if you know your end goal, the processes here can take 10 years, 5 years, 20 years, but you'll eventually get to your goal. So don't ever give up. Don't ever give up. I see people asking about the green card, the case numbers and all that, the way they're delays, and probably even you, you were sponsored, you came here and then your kids, you left your kids at home. It takes 2 years, 3 years. Just be patient. The, the COVID thing brought in so much backlog. And now you see the Ukraine, people are coming in. And like the backlog is crazy. Don't give up. Do not give up. The, like this country is here to help you. But they, they don't make you suffer. You just have to be patient and just never give up. Right, Chico? Yes, yes. We always keep hope alive here. Let me answer Miriam. She is asking, Shiko, how did you get Walmart scholarship? Once you get employed there, you qualify for the scholarship. 100% tuition. Actually, I was very mad at myself. Because when I joined Walmart, immediately I landed in the US in 2018. I was reading those posters about guild education and everything. And nobody explained to me. If I joined immediately, right now... I will be a graduate. Oh. Imagine, it has been there. Hmm? Wow. And they offer a lot, a lot of uh, courses. Imagine cybersecurity, computer, IT, whatever, all those courses. What they don't offer is nursing. But they offer a lot, a lot of management courses, everything free of charge, so long as you are working with them. And once you graduate, there is no contract that you continue working for them. No. Graduate oh, nice. Day, tomorrow, don't go to work. Nobody will ask you a question. <laughs> wow, that's amazing. That's amazing. And you, you see, I think... That we don't know. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. And most companies, actually, most companies are now following Walmart, Amazon, Google. They're trying to keep their employees by giving them incentives. One of the incentives is the scholarship. Right now, even me at school, there are so many scholarships for for women or residents, people who are not even green card holders or people people who are willing to go to school. Even if, by the way, did you guys know, even doc, undocumented people here in this country go to community college. They go to school. Because the school offers a haven for anyone who wants to go to school scholarship. And and th- don't let anyone t- uh, lie to you and tell you, oh, school is, uh, college is not important. If college is not important, would you be suffering to come here? Ask Shiko, Shiko, how can I get to US? And then when you come here, you say, oh, me, CAZ, I can't go back to school. I can't do this. No, if you had the opportunity to go to school, scholarship, or it's cheaper or anything, advance yourself, improve yourself, because here, we are already black. That's one, number one thing that's going to make you not land a corporate job. Mm. 
it is it's not it's out there it's just that you won't let that deter you from achieving those goals if you want to work in corporate america you are hr or accounting person yes you can get the job but already at the back of your head no you're already black you already have an accent you already have all these things that people already when they look at you go to the interview muko like five people and they end up choosing one person because, just because either they are white or their english is better than you or they don't have a graduate degree of course uko they don't they don't uh, focus on education but when you come here your ed- your education because you're already coming from an advantaged point coming from africa or all over the world you're not american take any 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 opportunity that's going to put you at a, a step higher than that person yes these people here don't go to school when you come here just go to school there are so many scholarship don't let anyone tell you at it's it's, it's not at you're going to college for what at you come here because you're getting $2000 every month and you think that's the bottom line people are earning $10000 a month people are earning $20000 a month yes it can be business but by the time you get to that business you must be doing something you must be doing something here not just sitting around and just going for double shift double shift double shift you're going to fall down by the time you get that 10k you're falling down you you i mean you're getting all these sicknesses just because you did doubles without investing in yourself mm. this money here is here to be made by the way don't give up this money here it's all over the place you just need to step your foot inside and invest in yourself don't let the $2000 per month cheat you that's like the bare minimum people get over here yeah. okay <laughs> yeah we are not settling for less no no those who come here through green card those are most advantaged because they are open to these opportunities come with a green card go work at warm omat go work at amazon those companies they sponsor your education 100% imagine someone studying cybersecurity rusi and paying nothing out of pocket wow. mm? that is the amazing sindio ah it's amazing it's amazing and imagine no. you are studying online so if you want to finish faster you take more classes yeah you're working and you are studying at the same yeah. time and you don't have any student loan amazing yes. Hmm? Yeah, it's amazing. But you have to work for them. That is now yeah. how they catch you. Work for them until you are done with your school. So they know how to, but who is benefiting? You. Yeah. Yeah, I and I also wanted to say uh, I have um if people are uh, for the people who are watching, you can actually get a job from home. I have a friend. She 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 was a HR like very good big company in Kenya. Mm-hmm. So I told her just apply for any any job that that shows remote job here in the US or can sponsor visa. She applied for one of the companies that I know. She actually told me this I think on Sunday. She applied it. She's at home. She actually got an interview and she was second place. Wow. In that job and it's remote job by the way. Mm. And they said if okay, eventually if she gets she's going to work prove herself. and they're going to sponsor her but she was number 2 in the position yeah. but they told her if there's another position that's going to open up they will consider her wow. i was amazed i was happy yeah you know like she went ahead just searched the jobs remote jobs mm. she was doing hr and she got it i'm like wow so it's possible yes nowadays uh since covid came so many jobs are remote and when yeah. i was in kenya actually i found three people They, work, uh-huh. they, they are in Kenya but they are employed in America and they are earning uh-huh. good money imagine when we are sleeping in Kenya here it is during the day so they are working <laughs> they are clocking. wow yes you know Amazing. what you know what it is you just kujituma uh-huh. kujituma is make an effort go on yeah. google and look for those remote jobs nobody will do it for you do it yourself God willing get a job and start working remotely. Eh? Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah, it's possible guys. Any anyway, I mean, it's possible. You just have to show that you just have to be uh, proactive and look for these jobs 
like I did a very good video that shows step, step by step. One of the best websites is indeed.com. Yes. Just Google's, uh, Google green card sponsorship jobs. I'm a remote jobs. Mm. Apply, see what happens. If you're successful, come and tell us here. Be a testimony to other people and tell them, guys, I got even an interview. You know, guys, how even getting an interview for any kind of job, you are a step higher than other people. Yes. You beat like the system, like the algorithm in the in the HR system that they use, <laughs> and your CV pops up as number top five. Yes. Just try. I mean, we're not saying you just wait for a green card to come only. Yeah. I'll try other opportunities as you continue looking forward to something that's going to pop up any day and it will not find you seated no, no way look for it <laughs> yeah Bunnies is telling you good advice lucy mm -hmm. oh she's asking um on my how did you ask a, a and p anatomy and <laughs> philosophy i just did my anatomy and let me tell you Girl, I I struggled because it's too much information. But I mean, I, I don't have a choice. I just have to get it because I know my the biology A and P. It's it's what it it's almost what's gonna determine if I'm going to the core nursing school. So I just had to study, create more time. I had to let go some hours of that I work so that I can do this subject, Bernice. Where are you, Bernice? Are you an international student or doing community college? Where are you? Maybe you're in Washington or Seattle. We could meet. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Lucy, I can see you are you are wearing your job shirt, right? Yeah. I so the, my shirt says I am a home care hero. A home care hero. Yeah. <laughs> that is your your work uniform. Yeah, yeah, this one, yeah, I was given, like, I was given just um, just merchandise at work. So they're proud of me. I'm a home care hero. <laughs> I, 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 you know what? I Yesterday, I posted a video of taking my kids to school. Sorry? Then, yesterday, I posted a video when I was taking my kids to school. And on the comment section, you see people asking, Shiko, the kids here, they don't wear school uniform. And I was like, you know what? The kids, they don't wear school uniform, but us. We, we wear uniform at work. <laughs> I know the irony. Yeah. It's the opposite. But anyway, <laughs> what's what's in a uniform anyway? It doesn't matter. You know, it's it's clothes. You know, it's clothes. Yeah. If I don't mind, on my day off, I put on anything that I want. You know. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Christine here is saying very true. Been applying via link and where? Put some your dinner. So Christine says, been applying via LinkedIn jobs. Good job, Christine. Just keep going. Keep going. When you're successful, come and let us know. Let us know that, Aki, I tried. I got an interview. I'm a Ilifikawapi. You know, where did it reach? Just tell us so that people can see it's possible. You just, you just, don't, uh, you just don't have to sit and wait for opportunity to come to you. It will never be like that. Never. Yeah, you have to look to work for it. Yeah. Or John is saying, can Walmart also sponsor an accelerated? Bit? No, they don't do nursing. They don't sponsor nursing career or nursing courses. They don't, but they do IT and those management, but not nursing. Yeah. So about accelerated program, because this is like a private program for yourself, they assume you have a degree. So they assume probably you have some money. So most people will not sponsor the accelerated BSM program, but the school itself has numerous like amount of scholarships that you can apply because you're already a student in the school. Most of the universities, accelerated, accelerated BSN is only found in a university mm -hmm. and most universities are public institutions. So a public institution means they have more scholarships from um donors from or people all over the world all over the country who are who are generous enough to give school um donations and that's what they call it scholarship okay so if you get your um for the first semester if you get your gpa 3.5 4.0 or if you're a single mother 
or if you are if you are disabled or you are um um I don't know any type of student whether male by the male people don't feel discouraged these scholarships are for everyone it's just that some people have donated and said hey I want my scholarship to go to a single mother and I, I want my scholarship to go to um somebody who is 40 years and above or you know there are those those um measures they put but this is not to deter you from not applying to any kind of scholarship this school has like so much money you just have to apply get inside the program apply make sure your grades are good because you you're not gonna get a scholarship with a 68 percent not just 60 you know 68 percent is like less than 2.0 gpa so mm. no one's gonna give you that so you have to put in the effort so that they can reward you and it's possible yes it is possible everything is possible and it calls for sacrifice mm. yeah Sorry? It calls for sacrifice. Yes. Yes. Like, like right now, where is your baby? Oh my God. My baby, I had to sacrifice to take him to daycare. Uh -huh. Daycare is expensive. But after this video, she could have been missing me on YouTube. It's because I'm trying to study. Because after work, I work now because he goes to daycare. I work for five hours. Then the next three hours, I go study, like now I have my final exam I'm doing this afternoon around 2.30 o'clock. I finish up, I go pick up the baby. I paid for the daycare because the money I'm working for right now, I just have to sacrifice. I don't have like, I don't feel any pain because the baby is busy with other kids. Mm. If we stay home with the baby, I'm not gonna go to, I'm not gonna do my assignments. Yes. I'm not gonna go to work. The baby is not gonna get social skills. Yeah. Because he's, he's not interacting. And the baby is going to get hooked on TV. <laughs> like, I mean, two, four, four things, four, four cons versus one pro. I mean, I just have to take him. I just had to sacrifice the money I'm working for. I take it to daycare. My husband is working also. He's busy also. We come home together in the evening. And oh. we call it a day. That's like It's not going to stay like this forever. I'm just sacrificing. Yeah. And now, the fact that I took advantage of online classes. Mm -hmm. By the way, because of this pandemic thing, our classes have been online majority. But my, my last, my last uh, unit for biology, um, some, uh, the lab work is, gonna, is going to be at school. So I have to figure out whether I will lose now these four, five hours that I'm working so that I can go to school, do my lab work. Of which I'll do, because... This is just happening for the next, next, this year and next year. Just two more years. Mm -hmm. We're done. Yeah? Two more years, I'm done. <laughs> yeah, I just wanted you to tell us about your baby because they are like, Lucy is a girl. She's okay. She can go to work. She can go to school. Sacrifice. <laughs> it's it's sacrifice. So I see... Um, Ojong Stella is asking an accelerated BSA in program. Um, is that a question or what? Yeah, we have uh, we have answered her. She was asking about oh. cohort okay. counseling, accelerated nursing. So here is another question for you. Okay, he is asking which school can we come to study English? <laughs> I understand it is another cheap option to come as a student. Is it? Can you tell us more about that? Um, so, um, when you go to, the problem is you can come study English, that's fine. But the problem is when you go into the embassy, they want to see that, um, like they want to see your case is, is, uh, is worth it, is worth a student visa. Mm. Okay. Unless now you're saying maybe you are a teacher, maybe a French teacher, or I don't know, something related to studying English. Then the embassy, and you have a, a narrative to say that, oh, I want to come study English so that I can go back to my country, teach them English, or just something that's related to studying English. Mm -hmm. But I can guarantee you, this is not a heavy, it's not like, a, well, how do you put, it's not a, a, an excellent reason for the embassy to give you a visa. Look for a course. By the, if you don't even have a diploma or, or maybe a degree, Look for a reason, let's say if you work, what, if you work anywhere, 
look for a reason and say, since I work in company ABC, I do this kind of job. So the reason as to why I'm going to study this course is this course and this job can align together, get me a better position, future goals, something that's, that's going to make, to make me improve my, the life that I have right now and improve my community. They always want to see you. You're coming here to study and go back home, mm -hmm. not to study and stay in the U.S., okay? That's number one. They always ask you, okay, the tie is back at home. Mm. What, what is going to make you come back home? Say family, of course, say your job. You love your job or you love your business. So you're not thinking of staying even a day after school. A reason that's going to make you come back home. Mm. They know people come and stay. That's why they don't want to give you the visa. I don't know why they make it hard. Or even if you show them that you have the money, or you know. But... There are other also opportunities that's going to make the embassy give you a student visa. Um, there's a program, um, one of our Kenyan guys, it's called Rob, uh, Robert Muiti. Yeah, Bob. He's, he has partnered with uh, banks that are going to give international students a loan to study in the U.S. Mm. But the type, of study, this type of studies is graduate, not under, undergraduate. Mm. It's... Um, business information technology or business analytics, something to do with IT, yes. mostly. So most people, I've, I've noticed for the last six months, everyone who goes through that program, again, this video is not sponsored by him. Everyone who goes through that program, um, the embassy gives them a visa. Why? They show commitment that they've partnered with a U.S. bank to give them a student, a student, an international student loan mm -hmm. for them to come to study, and then they're going to pay it off. So the the embassy is hooked on. Oh, you've taken a loan from our bank. Oh, that's serious. It means you're serious. Yeah. And then they give you a visa. But that program is for mostly Kenyans. I don't know if he's he's attracting international people. I don't know about that. But that's also one way that he has found to trick the embassy for people to get visas. And he knows how he's getting his money. I don't know how, but he's smart. Of course. And I hosted him here. So guys, oh. I said, go there on YouTube, search Shikohop Babumwiti. The video will come. Yeah. Shikohop Babumwiti. The video will appear there and watch that video. Uh -huh. very comprehensive video we, he took us through the journey and everything go, go watch that video if you have a bachelor's and you and you got a B a B in your high school he don't yeah. take anybody uh -huh. he, took, he, he take brilliant that is the name brilliant candidates wow a bachelor's already and in KCSE you had a B so it is not for everybody. It is for brilliant and smart students. Okay. Yeah. All right. That's amazing. I, I think, yeah, I think I saw something like that, but that's, I'm pretty sure people who are also interested in that program can check out that video Shiko is saying. Yeah. And also I wanted to, another clarification, anyone who wants to come here as a student, if that's the visa that you're able to look for, don't worry about what you got into in your high school high school diploma or a high school degree here in the community colleges they don't care whether you got an e or a d or an a they will just give you an entry level exam to to um to measure your english skills and math skills just that it's simple it's not even a graded thing they just want to see what's your level of english is it college level or is it still high school level if it is high school level you start at a lower unit instead of the Eng the English 101, which mm. is college level. Yeah. Or if your math is slightly lower also, you start, uh, they give you a subject to do to perfect your math skills so that now when you do the math, um, high uh, the college math, which is like statistics, you're able to pass instead of failing it again, like failing and then do it again, you know? Some of these programs, you won't go to the next semester if you've not uh, satisfied a certain grade. Yes. Like if you get less, like less, less than a 2.0 GPA, that's roughly 68, am I? 67. If you I get guess. less than that, 
you're not going to the next semester. You must finish this one, pass it, and then go to the next. Yeah. So whether you got a D, E in your high school, it doesn't matter. Here, the, what matters is your effort. And if you're willing to start lower so that you can perfect it, go, continue, advance all these prerequisites, whatever subjects, mm. whatever. By the way, we're not saying that you do nothing only. Uh -uh, just do whatever you want. Yeah. But I can tell you, if you don't have a green card, why do a course that's not gonna that's not gonna get you a green card? It's the sacrifice. Yeah. Get your sacrifice, get your green card, go back home to your kids, bring your people, empower your people. And this is what Shiko and I are doing in our YouTube channels. We are empower we are empowering you people to make better decisions in your life. Get the money, you know, help your family, live your life, and that's it. Yeah, exactly, exactly. They don't care what you got. What you got in what? That it is not like in Kenya that you have to, if you want to do nursing, they have to check your biology, sijui chemistry, sijui nini. Here they don't check. You can become anything here. You can become anything here. Even so, a doctor. Yeah. And a pilot. I saw somewhere a guy had a D minus in Kenya. Uh-huh. God opened a door for him and he found himself here. Imagine right now he's a doctor, a medical Hallelujah. doctor. Mm? Amazing. And he interviewed somehow and he was saying when he did his exam in Kenya, he was a little bit nervous. Maybe yeah. that's what caused him to fail in KCSE. But mm -hmm. he was not a fool. He no. was very smart. He came here and he worked his way out and he's a medical doctor right now. Yeah. Mm? <laughs> yes. Can you answer this guy here, a suitor? Are from four levers given scholarships. Um, what do you okay? So a form four lever is what? Like you finished your form four. Um the the point is if you, you want, want to bachelor's, maybe. Sorry? Maybe you want to come and do bachelor's here as a student. Um so so um once you know the prob the challenge is just getting to any kind of school like not even that the challenge is getting the student visa you can apply to any college like a form for liver is a high school diploma here and the transition is when you come from high school you go to your college right whether you see so long as you finish your high school but they, if you're going to college they want to see your high school certificate to to show that you like you cleared if you don't have it just go get it from your school or yeah so they want to see that certificate if they see that certificate they don't care about the grades you got because you now you're an international so you choose a course that that you want to do if you pass in your high school fine you can prove your case and look for scholarship that's gonna get you you know like um give you a scholarship because you pass but because it's very competitive look for a school Register for the school. The school is going to guide you on all the steps you need. By the way, if you have whatever, like you've identified you have family in Texas or you have a friend, Ama, you just Google the best university in the U.S. What comes, they have an email. Just email them. They will respond to you, I guarantee you, within three to four business days. They will respond to you. And tell, ask you, oh, okay, so which course do you want to do? You want to do business management or nursing? Oh, so you have your high school? Where's the evidence? Evidence is this certificate. That's it. Okay, so who's going to pay your fees? Your mother, dad, whatever. They ask you for bank statement. When you show them, the bank statement has to, like, um, they tell you a certain amount. You show them. They give you a form called I-20. This is the form now that you're going to go to the embassy and show them, oh, embassy, so my school approved. I gave them my bank statement. They told me I've, uh, I got admission. Embassy just wants to see admission, your I I-20, and your bank statement, and now your story. So you are a Form 4 liver. Okay, which course are you going to do? Why do you want to do it? And uh hey, -huh. do you have any ties back at home, whether it's family or anything? Most people, as a Form 4 liver, you don't, you don't have any ties. You might get the scholarship, uh, no, the, 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 the 
F1 student or not. I'm not sure why they don't give people, by the way. But once you get into the school, like you're in the school, they are more than 100 scholarships for all public schools. You just have to apply and see which one you qualify for. It's not like a scholarship has is waiting for you. Uh -uh. It's you, you become a student in the institution, whether it's just through admission, excuse me, or um, you've joined the school, you've, like, you've started class, and now the school is telling you, we have this amount of scholarships, apply. If you qualify, that's good. If you don't qualify, keep looking for scholarships. It can be hard for international students, but it's not possible. It is doable. You just have to look for them. And if you choose a course that has so many scholarships like nursing, there you have it. Or IT. Or Shiko told me she's doing health health records or something, right? I switched. You quit? I switched. I'm now doing IT. <laughs> what? Awesome. Yes. I switched to IT. Good mm -hmm. job, girl. Good job. You know what? Which, which speciality nothing, in IT? I had nothing to lose. Just switch your credits are transferred to this degree and you're good. Mm -hmm. Which speciality in IT are you, are you doing? <laughs> I'm doing business intelligence. Oh, business intelligence. Yeah. Wow. Good job. I'm sure Bob Mwiti told you something about business intelligence. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You know what? Networking, you, it opens your mind. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Now, Amazing. Interesting about admission and bank statement. The book, answer her. So, she called, she's asking, when asked to show a bank statement, is it my bank statement that will be checked or that of my parents or spouse too? Most, in most cases, the bank statement has to reflect the amount of money. You know, like if they're asking you for one million statement worth like of six months, you as a high school leaver, you don't have that kind of money. Mm -hmm. But you as a person, if you work and you have that kind of money or you have a friend who has that, just it's just you're telling them either my parent or my spouse is paying for me somebody who has that kind of amount of money you don't have to show yours because in the application you're saying who's gonna pay for your school fees maybe it's your job or your husband or your spouse mm. excuse me and people if you don't have that bank statement just look for ways you'll get it there's there are ways you can get it of course but how how much do you want this student visa? How much? Please just look for ways. There's, there's always a way. Where there's a will, there's a way. Mm. People, Some people who work in the bank, they know how to get you bank statements. Or maybe you have to pay something small so that they can make sure you have like a good record. I know it's really hard to get someone with such kind of amount of money, but it's doable. You just have to look for it. Just look for it. You'll get it. Yeah, you do. Everyone's an eye star so that we can finish. Sorry? Answer eye star. Oh, can you qualify to come to study for for master's if your GPA is 2.0 or below? Um, no. I don't think so. 2.0, 2.0 is, I think that's the cutoff. Yeah. 2.0 is the cutoff because they want to see okay, what's your commitment? But you know what? You just try because the admission process is not what you, it's, it's not like the visa process. You just apply to whatever school that you're looking for. See their requirements. Maybe they do, maybe I don't know. But of course, GPO is quite low. But just ask them. By the way, don't just ask the school, identify a school, yeah. ask the school if they can admit you. Maybe they'll tell you, Okay, so we need one more thing for you to qualify. By the way, just try, Esther. Please, don't give up. Just try. Yeah, try will not cost you anything. Yeah, and people, remember to subscribe to my channel. <laughs> yes, and it, uh, the writings uh, is moving. The writings are moving down here. Subscribe. Sorry? To Lucy YouTube channel. 
investing with Lucy Aisha. Hmm? Do you have the link you can copy paste in the comment? I don't know if I exit here, I think it's going to log me out. <laughs> so I don't want to touch anything on my screen. I'm using my phone. Oh, you're using your phone? Yeah. Let me see if I will be able to get your... Because, let me see. Invest. So anybody else with questions, I can answer you um, as we go because I'm about to exit. Yeah. I, even we, we are almost winding up. We have been yeah. here for the last two hours. Wow. 30 minutes. Yeah. Because, yeah. Uh, Shiko, because I have, I think I'm finishing my exams today. I think mm -hmm. I'll have some time, maybe, uh, I guess tomorrow or next week. I'll let you know. I'll let you know if we can also do another live <laughs> and probably with, with within your time, if you have some time. Yeah, mostly I will do live either Monday or Tuesday because those days I'm off. Okay. So from tomorrow, uh, I have to sleep. Okay. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. Maybe, still... maybe when we have some urgent news on DV on DV matters, but for me and you, we can do either Monday or Tuesday. Okay. Okay. Great. This person here is Jace Wakamau. Is saying I do not understand GPA. GPA is like grade. <laughs> so GPA, if if you don't understand it, um, just Google um gpa to you to like to letter grades like letter grades we used to get in our country we used to get a b c plus b plus so um those a a a minus ah, kuna a minus um <laughs> a minus, na a. Oh, a a minus b plus just google gpa to letter grade or let letter grade to gpa so for example an a like an A of A equal 80 points in Kenya or something. I don't know. I can't remember. <laughs> a is like a 4.0 GPA. Mm. If you get a B plus, a B plus is around um, 3.0 GPA. A 60, 60% 60 is around 1.5 GPA, you know? So here, especially in the nursing program or even most schools, they require you to have a 2.0 to proceed to the next. 2.0 is actually 73 to 70. No, it's what? 70 to 76. I'm a 75. 2.0. I, <laughs> I mean, I can't remember. You're also in school, Chico. <laughs> so I, I check GPA. I don't do ABCD. Oh, I know. Okay. So That's just like Google. By I the way, I'm Joyce. Just Google, you will see the translation <laughs> with the GPA. GPA, what does GPA mean? GPA is general points average or something. <laughs> uh -huh. Yeah, that is it. Brian, yeah. and I said, can one get a scholarship with a 2.57 as a transfer student? I, I think so. I think so. I think you can get. You can get because most scholarships, they already have requirements. So you just identify the scholarship, apply. You never know. Just apply. Don't let these questions uh, keep you back. Mm. Apply and see how whether is. you will get it. There's no, there's no losing. You're not losing if you don't, if you, if you apply and don't get it. Dalinda is saying, uh, "I'm interested to Walmart sponsorship for IC program. You have to be working for them. You have to be here." and work for them so they can sponsor your education. I think we are done. Duncan is saying which is the best paying jobs for those with less education. Eh? Able to appear to Malise? <laughs> you want me to answer that? Yeah. Tell us. My you friend, know. let me tell you, in this country, it's about, it's what? Your smart hard work. Here, less education means what? Like uh, sweeping the floor. Imagine there are people because here the, most of the most okay. Let me just say the wage or the salary is based on the average average what average income of the country. You could be having your degree and still sweep the floor, and they'll pay you fifteen dollars an hour. You could have a degree and maybe work in a hospital as a receptionist and get. $35 an hour. You could do anything in this country. 
whether you you have you could be a plumber a plumber or electrician in this country and you're earning eighty dollars an hour more than even a nurse more than even a doctor more than even a ward because you you perceive you pers you perceive um your perception on this job and education is completely different like it's parallel in fact here people with great like trade skills plumbing welding painting those are the people who have the money yes. because here they take your like hand jobs like kaziamikono like your skills more important than somebody who has education in their head Exactly. You find people who are doing accounting jobs in the office, they get 25 an hour, they have a bachelor's degree, or even I have a master's, but a plumber who went to school for six months, one year at a grade school, technical colleges in Kenya or Nigeria, they have just one year certificate. Actually, they are getting $50 an hour or even 80 because they're doing the practical thing. I would imagine if you stay in a house, you have plumbing issues. Are you able to stay in that house? And they, this place is so crazy. You get sued the next day. Mm. What? Just like the other day, one of my clients, she just called a guy to come take her stuff to the garage. Like she has a storage somewhere. And that guy is a maintenance guy. Do you know that what that guy charged her? She charged her, I think, $50 an hour. And it took him like three hours to get stuff from her house to the storage. I'm like, you pay this guy $50 an hour and... I'm getting how much? <laughs> <laughs> Don't <You> know. <laughs> I can't even say because it's like, wow, less education. No, it's not about less education. You have more practical. Yes. It's like, I can't fix up a, a, a pipe that is broken. I can't even leave, stay in that house because I won't survive. Mm -hmm. But this person, a plumber, hey, gets more money. For the guys, hi, baby. Um, for the guys who are wondering whether to get into nursing or any other job, school, I don't mean that you should go get like a degree. Just advance yourself. If you are an electrician back at home or even a plumber, when you come here, go to school to do that plumbing. Yes. You will thank me later. And so there's no job with less education. And come with a certificate. Don't yes. use certificates, but come with them here. They will say yes. <laughs> yes, there's another perception. At your certificates in Kenya, they won't work here. Uh -uh, yeah. It's a lie. Oh. It's a lie. Have you tried? Have you come here to present and tell them I have this? Yes, they will tell you, okay, you have this, but we need a, another one just to back this up. Mm -hmm. That's what you do. If they, don't, if they tell you this is not recognized, that's not the end of the road. Go take that course. Go to work. You get your money. So there's no job with less education. It's per perception. Huh? Yes. There is a day I was watching one of your videos when you were there with your husband. Yes. And he yeah. was and he was narrating his story. <laughs> and I yeah. was like, we need people like this. Men come out and talk to our people. Hmm? Yes, yes, it's true. Oh, mm. that video. Oh, we did a long time ago. <laughs> so he's in the finance, but he he thought of also cybersecurity mm -hmm. because. Why not? We are chasing the money here. We're not coming here to just sit. But let me tell you, Shiko, things are changing as we go. Yeah. I will share with you, but this is much later. Once <laughs> everything is falling into place, I'll share with you the journey now that we're also learning and realizing, Allah, Kuma, we can also do this. You can do that. You can do this. Once you meet people, they open up your mind. Exactly. So let me highlight this one for Sarah Kar Karenjo. He's, she's asking, what about real estate as a, as a career? And she's asking, Real estate. Mm -hmm. Real estate here is, is good. It's booming. You come here um, and then you get your, you, you study and get your real estate license and you start working with other people. You must work somewhere because now you don't know the market and it's, it's profitable. I know real estate is, is good. It's good. I've not done it, but I know it's good like the way we see it. Maybe you'll have some struggle, but just come learn the system as you go because you won't start selling the first year when you come here. You don't know the market. You don't know what. That's like a, that's a, like a long-term goal. You know, when you come here, you start with what gives you money. Yeah. Okay, you, come, you, you, you decide now, okay, I've gotten the money. 
go advance myself, get my real estate license, study the course. I think it's a course you study and then you get a license. Here, there's no job that doesn't have a license. That's how the government makes money. Yes. So you come study whatever course you are studying, um, advance, get that license, go to places, look for jobs, and slowly by slowly, you're moving to the next, you know, the next step. And by the time, maybe three, four years, you'll be in the real estate. You already know your market. You know what, what things that are required and all that. Real estate is good. It's very good. I think it's good. Actually, myself, I'm doing real estate. You know, I have to, I have to read wide. I'm in college, yes, but real estate is shorter. So on the other hand, I'm doing real estate. I'm almost done, my dear. And you know, wow. what? Mm, my my realtor, my the real estate agent that helped us to buy this home. Uh -huh. I talked to him and I asked him, "Hey guy, can you help me? Is this a good career?" And he told me, "Teresa, you can do it and help your community. Imagine people from Kenya; they will come through you because you are like them." And they can go to you. When I'm placed here and you're placed there, they will pick you to help them through the process. Wow. They will pick you and leave me here. So he told me, I'll help you. I'll hold your hand. Right mm -hmm. now, I'm almost done. And once I'm done, his company will take me. And he told me, this is the best career for you. You'll be working from home. Wow. Yes, you, clients, you communicate through phones and emails. Maybe he... You walk out when you are going maybe for a show, maybe when you would take your clients maybe for a viewing, and that is in the weekend. So wow. he encouraged me. And imagine he's a German. He told me, Teresa, I'll hold your hand because I can see you have a passion in this. Really? Wow. You, you study online. Whenever I have a question, I just call him. And he's taking me this. Let me stop there. Because once I have my license like this, maybe next in the next two months, Lucia will yes. celebrate. Oh. <laughs> wow, amazing. Wow, Shiko, you get, you're getting it. That's good. And the, the beauty of talking to people, they open your mind and they're like, this is not the only opportunity. Healthcare is not the only opportunity or there are other avenues you can try yeah. because there's no, there's, no, there's, no, there's no losing if you don't try. Okay, there's no losing if you try. <laughs> you try yeah, it. If it doesn't work out, next, next, next. The best thing with the real estate is you study at your own pace. Yeah. You are not at a limited time, mm, time limited. You have to finish yeah. this by this, no deadline. So it is your pace. Yeah. Take your time, read, understand everything, do the test, get your license, and start selling. <laughs> wow, good job. Good job, girl. Show so them. You're going to get the money. Come to the U.S. I'll help you buy your homes, guys. <laughs> yeah, that's good. That's amazing, Shiko. It's so been real. Thank you. Side hustles. Hmm? It will be one of my side hustles. Wow, that's good. That's good. I'm proud of you, Shiko. That's really good. Yeah, I asked him and he was like, Teresa, I can see you have a passion in this. Are you sure you can do this? And I'm like, yes, I can do it. And he was like, I found you. Go apply this school. This is where I studied. Apply there. Uh -huh. So I'm studying where he studied. And anytime I have a question, he's holding my hand. Have, have you done a video with him? You should do a video with him. We will when he gets time. He's so busy. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Remind me. Remind me with that video. I want to be in that video also. <laughs> <laughs> he will come. He will come. He's a German and his English is so good. We understand everything. He understands my English. I understand his English and we're good. Mm -hmm. Okay. Good. Amazing. Okay. Thank you so much, Chico, for having me. I <laughs> just popped in. And uh, yeah, guys, I hope you guys have been inspired. Anyone who is interested, you can follow my journey also on my YouTube channel. Just come. Come, baby. Come. <laughs> Yes, visit Lucy's channel. The link is pinned up there and interact more. Lucy is in one of our WhatsApp groups. She is Team New York. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. Okay, great, Chico. Thank you so much. Thank you. Bye bye. Bye. <laughs>
So guys, guys, I hope you have learned a lot from our sister Lucy. And now guys, can we end this live? Imagine we are almost three hours since we started. The Omaya girls, you just tuned in. We are almost voiding up. Sarah Karenjo, you saying you are in Dallas and in real estate. And you said you're going to Chico. I'm in Texas, Dallas, Chico, Nakutafuta. Sawa, sawa, tafuta mimi. Join our WhatsApp group and you'll get me or send me an email. hopeshiko one at gmail.com. At com. Okay, the pioneer. Imagine, I can't be telling you that certificate in telecommunication, this is how much you'll be earning. You know, we don't have them here. Go to Google and search in each and every state your course and how much they earn in each and every state. You'll be good to go, to go. Millicent, yes, low, it is marketable and they earn good, good money. Grace Wago, you know, she could hope my friend, you are not replying my message in WhatsApp. My dear, I can't reply right now. I'm live. I can't reply your WhatsApp message right now, my dear. It is not possible. Banis Bogwa, Shiko, I will be your client when you get your license. Oh my goodness. I have a I have a client already. You know, we have to do this. Sisi hmm? Niwale, we have Kujituma. Kujituma. For me, guys, you know, I love love, I really love homes and good homes and good houses. So let me let me attend this license and guys. Hmm? Mm -hmm. Musan, mm -hmm. let me call you Billy. Hi everyone. If someone is a, if someone comes at twelfth, how much money are uh, they required uh, to change it to PR? Mm -hmm. You come as a visit or a tourist, and you want to change it to P, to permanent resident. You can't change it just like that. Maybe get married to a citizen, or get married to a permanent resident, or maybe get a job. So I can't tell you how much money it is required. It, it is a, a, a process. You can't come and say, hey, I'm a tourist. I want permanent residence. No. Hello, guys. How are you? Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Hi, I'm Marisa Kubamoa. I'm going to wash it up. I'm going to wash it up. I will. I will. That's Marisa E live. I will be coming. Jay Kari, are you saying nice to see you, Lucy? Always watch your content. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Sarah, you saying real estate is my passion from back home, and thank you so much for that information. You're most welcome, Sarah. We are going to work together. Mm? Uh, John Stella, you saying she called, I now see you in my dreams, and I love that. Oh, really, my sister? You, uh, she called my son and spirit are in America. Mm? Keep hope alive, my sister Stella. One day, Grace Wago, it is not today or yesterday. Oh, so your WhatsApp messages. Imagine I have a lot of messages here. WhatsApp messages, so many, so so many. But hmm? investing with Lucy Unasema here is my channel. So click on this profile, and it will take you to Lucy's channel. And subscribe there and watch her videos. Mm -hmm. Maggie, uh, you think I should call good discussion and also I open up. I'll be a client once we get there, God willing. Amen, 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 amen. Jogi Watetu, hi, Shiko. Can you host me there? I think you just came and we talked about this. Plants are underway about hosting and accommodation. Hopefully, by the end of this month, Shiko will come here and tell you guys, don't worry about hosting, don't worry about accommodations. Once you come to America, you are sorted. Mm? Wait for it, guys. It is coming. Jogi, wait for it. Mm? Wait for it. It is coming. Ojong Stella Unasema in Yes, it is possible. Mili, you're saying I have always dreamt of going to America. And your dream is valid and it will come true soon. Guys, Tumalizani he live. Mm? I have been sitting here for the last three hours. <laughs> and I thank you so much for your interaction interactions. Thank you so much. I appreciate your comments. I appreciate your likes. I appreciate your 
sharing i think you i hope you have been sharing the video and if you have not subscribed to this channel kindly subscribe if you have not liked this video kindly hit like that like thumbs up button like the video and that's all the favor i'm asking from you just that subscribe like and share the video only that so guys if we get any updates between now and saturday i will not i will not hesitate to do a video about that maybe we come live so, because i'm starting my work tonight i work night so tonight i work until saturday night so whenever maybe we have any development diversity visa or any immigration news i'll definitely come here tomorrow morning or the other day or any day and and i will let you know if it is urgent and we will be interacting meanwhile continue watching our videos we have done so so many videos and i thank you even for the comments in the comment section that so many videos you have been asking shiko can you do this video she go do this video she could do this video we are still working on that guys you can tell shiko is a very busy person <laughs> i'm in school i'm in the university doing what i told you then i'm doing my real estate career course on the other hand i work full time i'm a mommy of four i'm a wife guys sees on the mob and i'm a youtuber guys you are still watching me here every day and then guys remember there are some other plans that are going on underway this is a hosting and everything so shiko is a busy mama that's why grace is complaining that she jaona was up yake because she is so much engaged which is which is okay we have to uh, to keep moving uh because it is what it is we have to do it i have to do it let me say myself i have to do it each and everything so don't get mad at me grace because sijakupata understand she is a very very busy person right now my today i was very lucky because no school today so the baby is with the other sisters he was here asking mom when are you stopping when are you ending this live because he's hungry so let me go let's meet in our new not in our new in our next videos uh continue watching our videos continue watching the videos we have done so many videos with the kids watch with your kids as well let them learn how life in america is what the video when they were going to school what the video at shilo in shiro's channel what the videos at jerry's channel we are going to we are going to pin them in the comment section after this live and guys we are in this together dv uh dv journey together in may 7 that's when you are going to look to check for the results hopefully we are going to celebrate here on this channel and i told you guys that day no sleeping we'll spend the whole night here checking the results checking the result i have taken a day off from that day on that day and it is already approved so as you change it is you are result is you see yourself and this is doing in me 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 banga checking the result in may guys sit to malize exactly two hours 59 minutes 27 seconds since we started god bless you have a good night love you love you love you all and continue liking us and loving us and more so pray 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 keep hope alive in our zekana in jesus name bye and good night